Welcome to the fourth annual Tiki Man Radio Songwriter Showcase, Key West Bound, keeping the music going virtually, brought to you by Box Line Box. Today we're coming to you live from Tiki Man Headquarters, home of the Chocolate Bar Studios in beautiful Harrison Bay, Tennessee, and from Rick's and the Dirty Harry stage right here in Key West, Florida, the southernmost point in the U.S. Hey, this is B-Man, and what a lineup of musicians we have for you over the next four hours. Stay tuned for Mike Nash, The Shanty Hounds, Tim Campbell, The Detentions, Robin Tricker, Marty Nickel, Todd Trusty, Laura Davidson, Jerry Gontang, Bill Crawley, Rick Lamb, two-time Josie Award winner Donovan Lee Carpenter, Nashville recording artist Jeff Dayton, and songwriting legend Keith Sykes. So sit back, relax, and let's get the show started. Take it away, Tiki Man and Happy Chick. All right, all right. Here we are for the fourth annual Tiki Man Radio Songwriter Showcase, Key West Bound, baby. We got Brian with Mike Nash down in Key West. How are you guys doing? Hey, B Man here uh, in Key West. Here, here, here I, here nobody should have to get up this early in Key West. <laughs> <laughs> we really appreciate it. We really appreciate it, man. Hey, I appreciate what you guys are doing here, man. This is uh, pretty cool. But it's, it's like we're taking trop rock into the future man that's, <laughs> that's right cool. that's right i know i know we're doing we're doing all kinds of production it's like the uh, space shuttle taking off you know like we're gonna five, have to start four, calling john patty pan solo <laughs> there you go there is you this go. not cool, pond, pond solo right that's is right. this not cool though danny oh man i have a mic nice down there opening uh, up the, the fourth annual i mean the, the music goes on virtually the music goes on and uh you guys are at uh dirty harry's at rick's and uh mike it looks like uh everything has been uh going pretty good down there i saw that you man found i'll a tell new, you what new location for people to go play and stay we we're working on something amazing to to kind of bring back the a feel of the, the lighthouse stuff that we were doing we're with uh, sam denzler and them but we found a, a condos place where we can bring all the musicians in one place because uh, you know we realize this is the only place that we're all together at the same time but we're always running and running and running and running so if we put everybody together in the same building then you know we're going to be able to do co-writes and, and catch up on stuff and plan the, the the next year's events and all this amazing stuff and this has been a fantastic week guys i mean honestly it's like we're hardly other than the amount of people that are here it's really not felt that different it's been amazing man so much love so much humanity and we all needed this it's been a lot of fun i've done more playing this year than i have in years past yeah. although but i've been I mean, always doing the tiki man radio thing There's you know it's amazing house. it's like it's kind of always been the town event you know for yeah. us yeah a casa and, and we really don't miss the casa part of it this year i mean it's like we're all doing the same things we've always been doing so very interesting to see what happens as we go into the future with the new phip now too Yes. You know, going to be a lot of awesome evolution in this whole thing we're all excited about. So, yeah. Well, there's a, there's a lot of changes coming, I think, you know, and I think, you know, yeah. maybe ho- hopefully for the good. I think you know? change I, is I, good. I, you know, we're, I don't think we call it change. It's evolution. We're evolving. No, you, you know? got any new stuff coming out? I, I'm going to yeah. play a couple of them today, as a matter of fact. Yeah, yeah I've got a couple of new ones. Um, uh, the one I'm going to lead off with is actually since the, this condos place, we've got our own pool back there. It's a big private area. There's only 16 condos, so we can sell this thing out and own a bar in Key West for a week. So we're like, what are we going to name this bar? Well, I've got a song I just wrote. I'm going to play for you guys. It's called Sticky Pete's Oysters and Half Shell Shack. Oh, very cool. Where life sure don't <laughs> shuck. <laughs> <laughs> so, so Very nice. Where are you going next after this? Uh, so after this, we actually hope, thank goodness, we got uh, a couple of weeks off, and then we're heading back down to Mexico uh, got buddy out there. Roger Klein does a big show. And, oh, yeah, that's right. You did. What was that show you did down there? Uh, the SOB Festival, man. I got to throw yeah. a plug in for that. We have, we've been doing it four years. This will be our fifth year in April. We're doing it uh, April 21st through 26th. And we have got this thing dialed in, man. It's like it's a beautiful resort. And we have a lot of great artists. We're able to bring more and more. It's like a miniature meeting of the minds. And this town is like a, a, a Mexican Key West. So it's super cool. So SOB Mexico, south of the border, that is. Yeah, but we do get some uh, SOBs down there, though. <laughs> <laughs> SOBMexico.com. Check that one out for me. Well, very well, cool. Well, glad to have we, you here. Uh, we got some great Beach Buddha coffee over there. Now, yeah. we're going to let you get up on that stage, let you do your thing, get ready for us. We got a crowd here. They're waiting to hear you play. So, Sounds thank you good so to me, much. guys. Thank you so much, Mike. We appreciate All it, buddy. We'll let you get go, ready. Go Vols, Tennessee. <laughs> yeah, there you go, buddy. There you go. Fantastic. Man, Mike Nash. Well, he's an awesome guy, I'll tell you what. Yeah. And uh, I can smell that Beach Buddha. It's in the air. <laughs> And we got it right here too, baby. You got it the t- there at the uh, Harrison Bay. You guys got their Tiki Man headquarters. So that's right. Uh, that's right. 
We'll get uh, we'll get Mike Nash going up here shortly. So here we go, Beach Buddha Coffee. Hi, I'm the Beach Buddha, and I'm Joey Beaches. We are the Beach, Beach Buddha, Buddha Coffee, Coffee Company. Company. Welcome to our office. Come on, let's go inside. Welcome to the inside. This is where all of our signature roasts are made. Our sunrise roast, which is our light roast. Our sunset roast, which is our dark roast. Our uh, signature coconut bay roast, which is taken the world by storm. And don't forget our Key West Cuban style espresso, rising tides. And coming soon, our new hazelnut bay. Does everybody know that our coffee is roasted fresh daily? right to your door. You can check it out at beachbootcoffee.com. And now take a trip with us as we head over to our roaster and drop some of our signature coconut bagel roast just for you at beachbootcoffee.com. See you in the roaster. So here we are by the roaster. We're getting ready for our coconut bay to come out of the hopper. You can just smell the heat of some beautiful roasted beans. Wow. Look at that. Take a look at the butter cooling process right here. Before it goes over to the next station, it'll be bed and grind. Once again, check us out at peachfoodcoffee.com, the best roast from coast to coast. Hello, Dirty Harrys. How y'all doing this morning? Tiki Man Radio live all over the world. So uh, I just found out some great news this week. Starting next year with the places, the places, the condos that we've got, we're going to be able to take over, make it a private event, and start doing house concerts and bring some of the lighthouse events back. And we're going to own our own bar in Key West for one week. So this is my dream has come true. I'm finally going to own a bar in Key West, and I'm going to call it Sticky Pete's Oysters and Half Shell Shack, where life sure don't shuck. There's a little shack off the beaten path. You can usually find me on any given night. It's the kind of place that's been around for years Where the oysters are Rockefeller or Spice just right There's old Coconut Joe and his Macarona Sitting in the corner smoking his pipe And the waitress carries married to the white He plays guitar in the band every Friday night Sings, oh well, what the hell Ain't none of us will ever see a million bucks But we can sit down here, run a tab on beer And sometimes that's just enough Down at Sticky Pete's Oysters and Half Shell Shack Where life sure don't shuck Well, every Tuesday there's a line around the building For 50 cent oysters and half price draft But I just slide a 20 across the table to Jimmy And he'll set me up with a bucket out back We watch the trade winds blowing in This week's return of those red-faced boomers With the money to burn and the whole scene It looks like a grand jubilee from my favorite chair on the back porch of Pete's Singing, oh well, what the hell Ain't none of us will ever see a million bucks But we can sit down here, run a tab on beer and Sometimes that's just enough Down at Sticky Pete's Oysters and Half Shell Shack Where life sure don't shuck Yeah, Saturday night's only five ninety nine for half a dozen a beer and a lime. They break them open quick as you eat. Mm, man, 
and this is the life. Well, every now and then we all need a break when life gets to getting too bad. A place you could sit and watch the world drift by just off the beaten path where there's always some room and an empty bar stool we'll save you a beer and a bucket so get down here fast we'll raise up our glass and we'll tell them all to just shuck it shuck it oh well what the hell Ain't none of us will ever see a million bucks But we can sit right here Run a tab on beer and man Sometimes that's just enough So remember when the going gets tough Put down at Sticky Pete's Oysters and Half Shell Shack Life sure don't shuck No, life don't shuck Go ahead and put a little hot sauce on. That's for my buddy Jimmy Parrish in Jacksonville, Florida today. Y'all come on down. <laughs> Thank you, guys. I'm getting used to singing to computers, but there's no clapping at the end of the computer shows. So thank you, guys. It's really nice to have human beings here today. <laughs> oh, we got time for two more, probably. All right, I don't know what time it is. So. Okay. All right, cool. Well, here's another new one for any of you guys who want to move down here to Key West from cold places like Denver, Colorado, or somewhere. Spent my life wearing shoes of leather. Tough as nails with toes of steel But they're no good in this island weather So I went shopping to find me a deal I tried on loafers, tried on sneakers I must have tried about 20 pairs of soul Started feeling like I was Cinderella with that leather in between my toes If the flip-flop fits, go ahead and wear it Life is short, you gotta live by the soul Cause that old tick-tock ticks and the moment's gone So you better grab a hold of it quick If the flip-flop fits My big old feet, they were white as winter Slow strolling down the beach Come next morning they were red as lobsters But they tan right up by the end of the week I wear them fishing, I wear them dancing They keep my feet moving nice and slow It's funny how your whole world changes with a little leather in between your toes If the flip-flop fits, go ahead and wear it Life is short, it's better lived by the soul Cause that old tick-tock ticks and the moment's gone So you better grab a hold of it quick If the flip-flop fits I flew home to Colorado And it was ten below zero Got some frostbite on my big toe. Ooh, I don't think so. Came down here on a week vacation. That was 25 years ago. So the house outside of Denver, and I blew it all on rum and coke. Call it the flip flop fits. Go ahead and wear it. Life is short if there's one thing I know It's that old tick-tock ticks and the moment's gone So you better grab a hold of it quick If the flip-flop fits If the flip-flop fits Go ahead and try one on oh, They come in all kinds of sizes and colors It'll save your soul. <laughs> Thank you. What are we doing on time, Brian?
How many, what are we doing on time? How many minutes? How many minutes? Thank you. Appreciate that. <laughs> you know, it's funny. I'm a musician. You'd think I'd be good with clocks and stuff, but I mean, I, the only time I can do is one, two, three, four. <laughs> All right. Well, I got a couple of new ones here. I'm going to do this. And this is actually uh, uh, one that's coming up on the new album. So from all my time and travels down in Mexico, I have learned we are all the same. Everywhere I go, I find that human beings are all the same and we all want the same things in life. And I think it's time we have a little more humanity in this world. So. Well, I was down out of money. I was dry as a bone. Standing on a corner in Juarez, Mexico Outside Camilla's cantina I caught a glimpse of hope When a gentleman began to speak to me He said he'd travel to Illinois Oh, thank you, Tiki Man Radio. Robin, how are you? I All right. You. Robin Tricker, how you doing, baby? Hi, I'm good. How are you, baby? Well, you know what? Anytime I can get up early on a Saturday morning and see your beautiful face and talk to you, <laughs> I'm doing really well. I got the hippie chick here with me, too. Hi, hippie so. chick. There Hi. you go. <laughs> so uh, we can't thank you enough for being a part of this again. Uh, and this year, virtually, this is like a whole new thing. It's so cool. I mean, that's there's a lot of technical stuff that goes into all of this. It's pretty impressive. Well, Thank you, you know, we are professionals, you know. <laughs> yes, you are. <laughs> <laughs> so real quickly, uh, you got some new music. Uh, I see the new song is out there. We played it last Sunday on the Sunday show. Thank you. Thank you. And, and it's been making its way around to all the radio stations. Really cool. Yeah. Different little vibe for you there. Different vibe. Yeah. Um, I wrote this one with my friend Lou Delato, uh, a.k.a. Lou Dog, and um. <laughs> And we wanted to get that that sort of Spanishy Latin flavor, hot night out in the city vibe. So yeah. with like a beach breeze, like Miami, you know? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Well, you could tell right away that uh, you set out to change, uh, which seems to be, uh, you know, as an evolving artist, uh, trying to not make everything sound the same, right? You know, because you want to write that, that, that way right. when it's really fun. But yeah. uh, changing it up seems to be a challenge, but you did it really well in that. And I noticed Thank it right you. away. Thank you. Um, it's it's I, I as a songwriter, I feel like whatever happens, like however the song wants to evolve or whatever feel happens with the song, I, I'm into it. Like it just let it happen naturally. And that's what happened naturally. And that's also the beauty of like working with or writing songs with different artists is that you mm -hmm. get, you know, something that maybe you never would have done and it becomes something new and, and interesting. And, and I, I always say songwriting or co-writing is like a box of chocolates. You never know what you're going to get. <laughs> <laughs> I like that. I like that. Well, we always know what we're going to get with Robin Tricker. And it's always a classy uh, song. And it's put well together and produced really well. Are you still using the same producer and everything? Yep. Still okay. working with Anthony Kryzan. Um, incredible talent, you know, able to put your vision into a song. It's it's also very it's super fun to to okay. god love going into the studio and working with him and my husband comes along and and the two of them produce me you know i sing in the sing in the box and they're like no do it again <laughs> well we got a few seconds again. here we're gonna let you get ready to get on stage uh there's michelle in the background there hi michelle <laughs> <laughs> But we're going to go ahead and let you get ready to go on stage. And thank you so much thank for you, uh, making time for this this well, year. Thank you for including me. I'm so excited. Thank you. All right. We'll talk to you. We'll see you on stage shortly. Okay. Yeah. We got Tune Designer coming up, don't we? Tune Designer's coming up with a quick commercial, and then we're going to go to Robin Tricker on stage. We make it super easy for you to get your song recorded with Tune Designer. First step is emailing us your rough song idea. 
We'll study that song. We'll get with you to make sure we know exactly what you want. Then we'll schedule a tracking day with a live band. We'll record that soundtrack and send it to you. Then we want you to record your vocal and send it back to us. We'll do a final mix and you'll have a great song that's ready to release. Hi everybody. My name is Robin Tricker and I'm here with my buddy Johnny Bongo. He's on percussion today and we are in beautiful New Jersey and it's beautiful and hot today. It doesn't feel like fall. Um, we are going to start with a song which I wrote during a pandemic, the pandemic we're having right now, and it is <laughs> Get in the Van. I've been dreaming a lot cause I'm stuck at home. I've been thinking a lot cause I'm all alone. My anxiety's high, my spirit is low. I need my friends around, I need somewhere to go. So I devise a plan, I bought a hippie van. 1962 color, ocean blue. I picked up my friends one at a time. Him on the cheek as they stepped inside, and we all sung. Get in the van, let's roll. Enjoy the open road and rock and roll. Get in the van, you're looking great. I miss your smile and your pretty face. Get in the van, get in the van, let's roll. We laughed a lot. I hope that everybody is doing well uh, during these crazy times. It's been so weird. I feel like I'm in like a sci-fi movie, Johnny. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Right. Are you the monster? I am the monster, and I wear a mask sometimes, <laughs> but not all the time. Not when I'm outside. That's why it's scary. <laughs> That's why it's scary. So this next song is um, Need More Bob, and I wrote this with Robbie Viola, my friend Robbie Viola. And so here it is. Breathe that, 
I just wanted to say thank you to Tiki Man Radio. And one year in 2018, we actually went down to Key West to the Tiki Hut and performed there with Tiki Man Radio. And I wore cowboy boots and I had many blisters on my feet. And I regretted that decision to wear cowboy boots. And I wore um, no shoes for the next week, the week after we traveled down there. So very silly of me, Johnny Bongo. So this next song is Bye Bye Go. Feeling positive, feeling free. Then I feel you judging me. Oh no, no, no. what I say. You 
Drink, Johnny. Yeah. Have a sip of your beer. <laughs> so, cheers, everybody. Hope you guys are doing okay with all the craziness. Team sip. Ready? One, two. Wait. Where? Well, are we supposed to do? Are we supposed to do that? I don't know. Okay. Cheers. <laughs> so, one more thank you to Tiki Man Radio. Thanks for having us today. That's Johnny Bongo. I'm Robin Tricker. And you can actually find us um, on all the usual, usual places. So Facebook, Instagram. John is at Dr. John Bongo. Huh? Yep. Huh? Yeah. And um, you can find everything of mine at robintricker.com. Facebook, I'm there. I'm on Instagram. Put in the name. Um, so this song I wrote before the pandemic when I was having a lot of fun. And the name of the song is... Fan of fun, so. So get up and dance, that's right. When I used to have fun and get up and dance. <laughs> Get up on the dance floor, be 
Thank you, everybody. And now back to the Chocolate Bar Studios in beautiful Harrison Bay. All right, man, I'll tell you, Robin Tricker was the bomb. I can't believe she uh, she was, uh, you know, having a good time up there. It looks like it's a little warm up there in New Jersey. But uh, now we're back down in Key West with our good friends, the, the Shanty, Shanty Hounds, Hounds, Key West Chris and Danny Hoy. How are you guys doing? We're pretty good. Yeah, everything's good. Everything's good. Yeah, well, it looks like uh, somehow or another we've been able to pull off this whole music event down in Key West. And uh, I can't thank you guys enough for uh, – participating in, in the, the fourth annual Tiki Man Radio Songwriter Showcase virtually. It's a whole nother production. We, we oh, couldn't say no. Yeah, and, and also, you know, <laughs> thanks to uh, you you guys and Brian and Michelle for putting this all together. I know it's a lot of work, even for oh. the regular gig, and this one's even more. Oh, my God. Don't even know oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. I like to tell people I go from flying a, uh, a pond hopper plane to a 747 because I got all these cameras and everything does. now. So, yes. <laughs> Cessna 152 coming in for landing. That's right. That's right. So, sounds like we got a big crowd down there for you guys. And, uh, you know, it's funny. I was telling uh, Brian when we started talking about coming over there to uh, where you guys are now. I've never been in that part of Rick's. I always came where you guys were, obviously. Right. You know? So, Me it's kind of nice back there. We play up, up front on at Rick's downstairs every Tuesday, yeah. three to seven. Yeah, we've been doing that for yeah. four years. So, yeah, so. I've never been to the dirty. And we, we, matter of fact, I, I had a songwriter's event twice here on this stage, and then also the set uh, when they've been doing uh, construction, we've played here as well. So, it's yeah. a shanty on. So we're acquainted with it. Well, that's lot. cool. It's uh, looks like it's been a busy week down there. Yes. Yeah. 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 It's okay. been steady. I mean, you, you can tell it's not as many people, but it's been steady down here. Yeah, but at least we've gotten the place on together. You know, they yeah, finally, finally they, they finally opened for me. <laughs> <laughs> well, you know, I, you know, you guys, you know, we love you guys, and uh, we miss, uh, miss being down today. there. But this was the next best thing, and we really appreciate it. But we're going to let you guys get ready and get up on stage. Okay, all right, all right. time for the shanty house. See you. All right. Thank you. Love you. Love you. All right. All right, well, I'll Brian. tell you what, you know, they're going to go up there and get ready. And uh, we, the crowd has just grown unbelievably. So nice. Nice. That's what we want to hear. I'm sure uh, it's like Rick's there. Is certainly Please. Clorox wipes. Clorox. Hand sanitizer. Ironically, a little enough, bit of Lysol. Yeah. Spray ironically them. enough, the uh, chocolate bar is starting to fill up as well here. So, uh, yes, yes. yeah. All right. It's, so uh, Beach Buddha Coffee's here. We got Jim from the Key West Trading Company. He, surf Riders just showed up. Oh, nice. um, I'm telling you, it's, it's really, really gotten a large crowd. This is going to be a good time. And uh, we'll get the shanty house up here shortly. I will give them the high five. And uh, you, you got a crowd there at the chocolate bar, too, don't you? Oh, we have we a do. Crowd yeah. Already yeah, the Fishers just walked Fishers. in. And, uh, we've got yeah. Pat. We've All got right. We got a quick commercial right quick coming up with uh, Mask Hole. All right. And we'll be mask back. Mask Hole. Don't be a Mask Hole. Hi, it's Amber and Chris. And we're in Key West. What was that? It's Amber and Chris, and we want to tell people about wearing the mask in Key West. Wearing what? Wearing a mask, you mask hole. Oh, wearing a mask. Oh, yeah, you need to wear a mask, everybody. Everywhere, even in your cruiser? Even in your cruiser. How about in your hotel room? Even in the hotel room. No, not in the hotel room. If you can't social distance. What? The winter season is oh so cold, so bad it almost froze my bones. I'm gonna pick up my friends. At my clothes and towards summer at the end of a long road to cruise director the end of a long long road
I'm glad a lot of our friends could come to the Keys, come to Key West, we got Kongfish, the Kongfish Nation, we got Parrot Heads, we got Castaways, we got all kinds of people here joining together over music. I'm Danny Hoy and here is Key West Chris. Good morning. Good morning. Thanks to Tiki Man Radio. We've got some beach food and coffee stuff going on and Key West Trading Company. Mm-hmm. Alan Jacks Bowers, what's up? Have, has Cajon will travel. <laughs> Sorry we missed our coffee date. <laughs> I know where we can get more. Right? That guy's got coffee. As far as things, you know, we live here, so I usually write songs about being here, but now and then you leave here and you have to come back, and that's what this song is about. It's called My Little Island Town.
Certainly could be worse. Yeah. It's been Shanghai for a dozen years now. Well, contrary to popular opinion, the name of the song has not gone naked. Yes, it is. No, it isn't. Naked. No, the song has nothing to do with being naked. <laughs> the song's on my second album, Songs of Love in the Ocean. It's called Gone Native, Not Naked. Lived up north, damn close to 50 years, wishing he was somewhere else, many miles away from here. One day he took a plunge, finally took that airplane ride, flew south to an island town, playing touchdown east side. And now he's writing songs, playing music to the crowd. His dream is finally real, he's living life out loud, he's going native.
take that flight. Are we ready? Change my life at last. Thank you, Tiki Man Radio. Tiki Man Radio is going naked. <laughs> and now back to the Tiki Bar in beautiful Harrison Bay, home of the Chocolate Bar Studios and Tiki Man Radio. All right, we're back here in the Chocolate Bar Studios with Mr. Jeff Dayton, of course, virtually. How you doing, brother? I'm doing great. Can you hear me? I can Absolutely. hear you, man. I, I, you know, I, what, I, I, we had such a great time with you last year in Key West, and I know it was your first time going down there to play. It was, man. Gracious enough to uh, uh, come over and play the Tiki House with us last year, and uh, we had such a great time. Who knew that was uh, going to be like a, a great moment captured, and we don't know when we're going to make it back down there again. We <laughs> are going to make it. I have faith. We're going to do it, guys. We're going to do it. Hey, you know, for everybody listening, uh, you don't know how many people are behind the scenes on this, like Cheryl and like Coconut Television, and, um, you know, Brian and, and all you guys, um, Danny, of course, and my favorite, my vote every year for Hippie Chick of the Year. And, uh, <laughs> so, you know, it's great to be with you. Oh, man. Well, we really appreciate that, man. It has been a lot of work, but. You know, there's been so much things that have been canceled and, and uh, you know, but I always try to find a positive in everything. And what it has done is forced everybody to get out of their comfort zone. You've been doing your live shows every week and just having a lot of fun with it. Yeah, I, I really enjoy doing that. I get to throw some love out there and hopefully that's healing a few people. Uh, you know, folks are kind of depressed about this whole thing. And, you know, music is a great healing force and it always has been. And I, so I'm happy to be part of that. And you guys are doing that, too. I mean, you know, the good vibes of Tiki Man Radio, who can top that? <laughs> well, you know, again, you know, Brian and I sit down and we're like, okay, what are we going to do? How are we going to do this? Because you got to think back to like April or May. We didn't know what the world is going to be like, and, and nobody did. So we just had to come up with a different plan, and we, we put our heads together. And Brian and I working together, there's nothing we can't do. So I can't the, amount, the, the amount of work you guys must have had to do to do this thing, I mean, you know, when I was down there at the chocolate bar last night. Yeah. Yeah. Jeff, Jeff, let me tell you, I'm in Key West, and it was a lot of work. <laughs> <laughs> but this will be all part of the history of uh, – this show one day, you know, and of course, next year we go back, it'll be our fifth anniversary of the Tiki Man Radio Songwriter Showcase Key West Bound. Maybe we'll get you back down there again one of these days. Put me down. Fall, yeah. of, fall of 21. I'm there. Well, there awesome. you go. There you go, man. We would love to have you back down there. And uh, so uh, you've been enjoying your, uh, it sounds like the, the, the following of your weekly show has just become uh, amazing. It's been a lot of fun. Yeah, I've got a great family of folks. We call them the Twangsters. The Twangsters. I like that. I like that. You know, you're never supposed to wear your own swag, but just for today, I thought I would, you know. Real quickly, you know. the Live from the holler. Go ahead, Danny. I'm sorry. Yeah, real quickly, the uh, uh, the passing of Jerry Jeff Walker. Did you ever have a chance to work with him at all? I did. Um, in fact, both, a bunch of my friends from down there on the Gulf Coast uh, used to go to Belize to hang out with him where he lived uh, recently. But I, I got to open for him uh, years ago, and it was like one of the high points of my life. I just I had such a great time. Wow. And uh, man, so many songwriters, we've lost so many great songwriters this year. It's been unbelievable, you know, so, uh, but, you know, we're trying to do our part with keeping the, the music going uh, virtually and live and having a lot of fun with it, man. That sure is great of you, Danny. Thank you guys. And Brian and you know, Heather and everybody. I'll yeah. tell you what, this, this has been a labor. This has been a labor of love. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, oh, it definitely uh, But is. I'll tell you what we're going to do. We're going to go ahead and transition and let you get ready to, to uh, uh, play for us. And uh, I'm going to go back with Brian, man. Thank you again so much Thank for being so a part much, of this, Jeff. okay? Love being here, guys. And, you know, all the best to you. Aloha. Mahalo. Yeah. Aloha. Mahalo. Appreciate it. There we go. Brian, you got hey. a big crowd down there? Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Well, you know, he's like, there's a shanty house doing their thing. Yep. You know, and you got me right here doing my thing. This place is packed. We got surf riders in the house, Beach Buddha Coffee doing her thing, Key West Smuggler doing her thing. We got a hell of a sand my, uh, sound man here. We're just having a lot of fun. Well, there you go. There you go. Well, man, it uh, seems like everything, everybody is chiming in on the YouTube channel saying it's sounding good, being good, and, and uh, that's all great. So we got just a few seconds here, and then we're going to transition and let uh, Jeff play. Well, I'm all glad right. everybody is hanging out with us. Absolutely. All right. We'll talk to you soon. Hey, everybody. This is Dave Signs from MFG Records in Nashville. 
stands for Music for Grown-Ups. Hey, this is Beth Travers from MFG Tropical, who wants no part of being a grown-up at all. <laughs> We're here sponsoring the Tiki Man Radio live cam feed. Us and our, entirely, our entire family of artists, which includes who? Jack Mosley. Yeah, and Rudy Cox. And Dave Sines. And Beth Travers. <laughs> hey, Jack. Hey, what about <laughs> Mac Martin? Mac Martin, yeah, and also Greg Hager, who's our, our Western artist. We are super grateful to the family at Tiki Man Radio. Absolutely. The Tiki Man, Danny Lynn, Heather Mosso, Shields, the original hippie chick. We got J-Man, B-Dog, and Monica, the producer. Um, we're just super grateful to you for playing the MFG family of artists. That's right. Thank you, Tiki Man Radio. All right, let's do one, okay? What do you say? Here we go. So much I put it on two different records. Hope you guys like it. My favorite beach is a tropical island with sugar white sand and one palm tree. Little fat shut song still in the water where we can live easy and barefoot free. My favorite beach is up on the North Shore where the sky gets. So blue, good grinds and good times. Watching the surfers playing ukulele and singing about you. My favorite beach is no big secret, it's a little piece of paradise. came to me one day i love it when songs just show up you know if you've got that the receptor ready you know there's a hole in the ozone and down they come <laughs> this song uh just i mean i love the title and i tried to find the song to go with it so this is the title track from my most recent album love will survive that's what they say Yeah. 
I'm calling the ocean to rise for me And carry her back on the tides to me And help her remember our days in the sun And let her forget all the things I've done But yeah, help her remember our days in the sun And let her forget all the things I've done Whoa. fun hey if uh if anybody's looking for my music i don't know where it is it's out there somewhere you know it just it goes out to places and if you can find it it's their band camp you can actually download songs out of there and uh they get they pay me so whatever you pay they pass along also uh, i think spotify and whatever's left of itunes and all those places i'm sure they have it too so check around and if you can't get it you can email me at Jeff Dayton music at gmail.com and I will make sure you get something. So there you go. Hey, thank you so much again for having me today. This has really been fun and uh, I love, you know, getting to share some music and stories with folks. And I hope you're enjoying hanging out and listening to all the artists. Um, they're just, aren't they all great? Um, I also want to thank uh, Danny, you know, Tiki man and hippie chick and B dog and everybody at Tiki man radio. And all the other outlets that support our music, you know, all the great uh, internet radio stations that are playing drop rock, beach music, beach, what do they call it? Coastal Americana, um, you know, just anything like this, you know, this is our, our thing. And we've got a great community of people. Also want to thank all the folks who are doing their music online. I've got mine at Jeff Dayton Live, facebook.com slash Jeff Dayton Live. And three nights a week, I've got a thing on there. It runs from uh, Mondays and Wednesdays and Fridays. And I do uh, requests on Wednesdays. So you can check it out and send in a request. And also thank you for downloading the music or at least streaming it, Spotify and all those places, Apple Music. Uh, Bandcamp.com is another place you can actually pay what you want to for a whole album. And, and we get a little bit of money that way. And that's a lot more than we make, um, as you probably know from uh, the streaming sources. So thank you guys for supporting our music and hope you've had a great day. Wrote this song with Aaron Lee and uh, it's one of my faves. Said hello to Little Harbor Town, where the sun and the boats pop up and down. Heard a song on the wind with an island sound. Man, I like them like that. So I follow the sand to a tiki bar, where the locals and the desperado start. Getting drunk at noon, telling stories about scars. Shipwrecks, pirates, and gold. Yeah, shipwrecks, pirates, and gold. Without a care, man, I like them like
What's a beauty like you doing down here? She said, I quit my life, changed my career to shipwrecks, pirates, and gold. Yeah, shipwrecks, pirates, and gold. And she said, We drank to the men and the dreams and the love gone bad. And all the buried treasure that we want back. Tell me what you think about a wide picket fence. Well, if you ask me, it makes perfect sense. So tell me what you think about a wide picket fence. Well, if you ask me, it makes perfect sense. I can have you to myself all day and all night. Here's how Tune Designer works. All you got to do is email us your rough song idea, and then we'll make a soundtrack for you. Once you get that soundtrack, you record your vocal, send it back to us and we'll do a final mix for you and your song is ready to go we cover a lot of genres at tune designer we'd love to help you if you want to know more about what we do there's a ton of information on our website there's a lot of videos on our facebook page you can see exactly who's going to play your song and how we do things we'd love to help you all right, man, I tell you, I just love Jeff Dayton's music, and I really appreciate him uh, doing this again. He's such a humble guy, but uh, now we're back, and we've got Lauren Davidson with us. How you doing, buddy? Hey, I'm doing great. It's good to see you guys. Yeah, gosh, we, you know, we were just talking behind the scenes there in the green room that uh, it's been a while since we got to have you up here at the old uh, Tiki Bar, and we, got, we need to do that in the yeah, near future. Yeah, a year ago June. Yes, yeah, absolutely. Right. So you've made a lot of been... changes. I'm looking forward to seeing it one of these days. Well, how are you doing uh, through this whole crazy year down there in Eaglewood? I'm I am grateful that I am healthy and relatively happy, and that I don't have to leave the building when I don't want to. That's right. right. That's well, so when you when you got a, a big time radio myself. station doing a production like this, you don't have to, right? Yeah. You don't have to go anywhere. I, I'm just amazed. I, I'm grateful for the technology that lets us do this too. Yeah, absolutely. Absolutely. So have you uh, been playing at all anywhere in Inglewood or just, just lay no, low? I, I, I did a couple open mics back before uh, we went into shutdown. Mm -hmm. And right now I'm pretty much considering myself retired, except yeah. for things like this, because, you know, A, I don't want to be out you know, breathing, breathing song, song breath among yeah. people whose health status I don't know. And yeah. B, there's so many people out there who rely on the income they get from performing and I don't need that. So I'm, I'm letting those people do it. And I'm like, maybe this is a good year to just step back and say, you know, I've had my fun, I've done my thing and just kind of stick my fingers in every now and then when somebody invites me. Well, you know, uh, when so we were talking about going, for this. yeah, when we were talking about going down to Key West or not going to me, it was like going to a, uh, an amusement park and all the roller coasters were going to be shut down, you know? So right, I'm like, so I'll fun. just wait till the roller coasters are back up and rolling. Yeah, right. Well, I went I down a few weeks happened. ago and, and I hung some with Brian and with Chris and Danny. Mm -hmm. And it was great because I got to get my Key West fix without as many people. Yeah. Yeah. And I think a lot of people, I know the conch fish have been out on the water and, right. and uh, enjoying themselves. And, that's cool you know yeah that's uh, cool they're but, not in the bars getting closed up and so yeah. it's really good yeah all that good stuff really you know but uh so i'm glad you're staying safe man and i can't thank you enough for uh you've been part of this thing every year and now virtually Four this years. year we really Four appreciate years. that I, yeah. I, right. 
I am consider myself fortunate that you're still putting up with me after all this time. Are you? Well, we're I love we love you just... all, and, and I really appreciate it. We love all right, we're going to let you get ready to play. We appreciate you, man. Thanks a lot. All Thank right. You. Thanks, Lauren. Thank you so much, and uh, we'll, we'll see you on the other cam in a minute. Thank all you. Right. Thank you so much. Hey, plogging in Key West. I'm always out picking up trash. Yeah. I'm always Absolutely. doing something. I help Dee Dee Green, and she's got these really cool commercials that she always throws out here. So here comes one at you now. Aww. Browse on over to keywestrecycles.com. With these tools at your fingertips, you can be the captain of your own sustainability. Happy Saturday. Happy Halloween. Thank you for tuning in. And I got a few songs here for you this afternoon. Um, this one, I don't think I wrote in Key West, but I wrote it right after a trip to Key West. And time spent thinking about wanting to see that green flash. And that really, um, whether I see one or not, time spent watching the sunset is never wasted. listening wherever you are watching wherever you are it's a strange year we've had but we're still all hanging in there and we're still doing the best we can I can't be in Key West right now but uh, if I were I'd be enjoying wandering around and uh, seeing people riding around on those wonderfully artified Key West bikes <laughs> Friends who pedal in style, but they make the tourists. 
Kiss on the beach, girls smile for me, they'll borrow their idea for traveling through town. I'll get a Key West bike, customizing the way I like. I'll breeze, cruising along beneath the palm trees, riding day or night on oh, my Key West bike. Shark, gray and white or mako with blinky colored LEDs for riding around after dark. I've got a little dog named Travis McGee. Pretty girl stop to talk to Travis and me when he's riding in a special hand basket up on the bars. On my Key West bike, customize the way I like. Along beneath the palm trees, riding day or night on my Key West bike. Like a pedal powered on car, two wheel port a bar with 12 volt chiller in tow. Oceanside, go side by concrete, we fight a ride everywhere I go on my Key West bike. Customize the way I like. Along beneath the palm trees, riding day or night on oh, my Key West bike. Key West bike, riding on my Key West bike. Key West bike, on your left. Key West bike, slow down the Saint the mainland. Well, I want to give some thanks here to uh, the good folks at Tiki Man Radio who are broadcasting this and who've been nice enough to put a lot of effort behind making this happy for the happen bleh, for the last four years. Also to uh, Brian Fields, who's done so much of the work to put these on and promote them, and to his lovely wife Michelle, who does a lot to support things also, and to every single sponsor and person who's helping make this happen this year and all the years so far. Um, speaking of Tiki Man Radio, funny thing is, a few years back I came up with a song and it turned out the title of it also was, became the motto of Tiki Man Radio uh, for its own good reasons. Um, and I got the idea for this song watching, uh, well I was on Facebook and I saw a picture of this parking lot down in the Keys, down around my marker 24, you know, Howard Livingston country. And uh, the sign, one piece of it said, jet ski rentals. And the other piece of it said, free beer. And I looked at it and I said, what could possibly go wrong? <laughs> Helps better if I hit the right key. Sandbar. What's the worst thing that could happen? What could possibly go wrong? Maybe someday we'll be laughing or wind up in somebody's song. One of you could hold my beer. Well, I'll try to turn this sucker on. I mean, what's the worst thing that could happen? A thousand moon candles to the bottom of this chair. I bet you we can make it fly and hover in the air. Put out some old mattresses so you've got someplace soft to land. We'll film it all for YouTube. Now that's an awesome plan. What's the worst thing that could happen? What could possibly go wrong? Maybe 
someday we'll be laughing or wind up in somebody's songs. I took a high school class in physics, so I know just how this should be done. I mean, what's the worst thing that could happen? What could possibly go wrong? Take it back a band. Chasing some big badass ghost who's haunting people's dreams. I bet you we could catch him if we just don't cross the streams. Hey, look, we finally got him. Sorry about the mess. We'll send an invoice in the morning. Pay it or be repossessed. What's the worst thing that could happen? Got this nasty proton gun. Cross your fingers and switch me on. I mean, what's the worst thing that could happen? What could possibly go wrong? What's the worst thing that could happen? What could possibly go wrong? Maybe someday we'll be laughing or wind up in somebody's songs. Tell you we're professionals So kids don't try this stuff at home Now what's the worst thing that could happen? What could possibly go wrong? Thank you all so much for tuning in today. Happy Saturday, happy Halloween, and thanks once again to Brian and to the good folks at Tiki Man Radio. Hi, this is Chris and Kat Farrar from CK Sunrise Villa. Home of the Second Chance Bar, and you are watching Tiki Man Radio, Songwriter Showcase. Key West, West Bound. Bound. Stay tuned for more of your favorite trap rock artists. Woo! Have a great day. All right, all right, here we are. Lauren Davidson wrapping up there. And we, you know, we really appreciate Lauren doing this every year. Four years. But now we've got uh, Chris, and we're back with Brian down there. Chris with the detentions, and uh, Dan is setting up. How you doing, buddy? I'm great. Hello, you two, and uh, all the Tiki Man fans all around the interwebs, around the world. Yeah, man. uh, Happy Halloween. Happy Halloween. Yeah, you know, we've been so wrapped up in trying to do this, we forget it's Halloween, but everybody here in the bar has been reminding me of that. So, yeah, you know. I'm looking forward to throwing candy at kids today. I'm going to let them get to the end of the driveway, and I'll spray them with a hose to keep them away from me, and then I'll throw Snickers at them. Well, there you go. There you go, man. So, well, as we know, it's been a crazy year, and you guys have been kind of being on the down low and uh, taking it easy and safe, and uh, I think that's uh, probably been the right thing to do. We've been doing the same thing here. So uh, what is kind of new with you guys? What's uh, What's been going on? There has uh, been absolutely nothing has been going on. Uh, we're playing a show tonight. It's the third show we've played since everything closed down in March. We're going to stand out at the end of the 18th green on a stage out at a country club and and play songs for the golfers as they come off from their uh, holiday Halloween uh, square match, I guess, today. But uh, we're not doing a lot. We're, we, uh, you know, it's hard to write, hard to write trap rock music in the quarantine. So yeah, that's, uh, we, a, that's, that's an interesting uh, statement. I mean, uh, you're kind of the first I've heard that's, that's, that said that, but you do have to put your mind in a, in a mindset of, uh, you know, places that you're going or whatever. So creatively, this kind of puts you in a whole different place, uh, I would think. I would think that our next record is probably going to be more of an instrumental heavy metal uh, sort of thing. I'm joking, yeah. kind of, but uh, <laughs> I I try to write, and it just kind of comes out as angry guitar riffs that aren't appropriate for a two-man acoustic trap rock act. So, uh, <laughs> ironically it, uh, enough, uh, ACDC just came out with a new one, so uh, they've they been doing did. the same thing. <laughs> they did. I can hear a lot of uh, Angus's brother uh, yep. in those riffs. Uh, yep. God rest him. And uh, yeah. yeah. 
Glad yeah, to they see were, Brian Johnson back in the fold too. I love I was that a little, voice. I was a little worried about that. I didn't know if he would ever be able to do that again. So it is nice to see him back uh, with the band. Yeah, it's. Uh, I just listened to an interview with Huey Lewis, and he has the same issues going on with his hearing. So he's uh, just he can't really perform too much either. It's crazy. Yeah, I guess. Well, listen, listen, man, we're gonna uh, let you get ready. You and Dan are set up, and uh, we're gonna let you guys get set, ready to go. We got a few seconds here. I just want to thank you personally. Uh, thank you <coughs> for once again doing this with us. It was nice down in Key West, but glad you're here today, man. Chris, keep smiling. <laughs> Chris, nice. Thank you so you much, Chris. Too. Thank right. you so Be much, surprised. Chris from Key West, man. Appreciate it. Wow. <laughs> Danny, this place is crazy. I can't believe the amount of people here. That's nice. That's nice. Uh, uh, but man, we got to transition pretty quickly here. Key West recycling, baby. Here we go. Hey, everybody. It's Amber from Key West Finest. And yes, I'm in Key West today. Hi, this is Chris Farrar, AKA the mayor. Remember private message us on this page with any questions about Key West. If you want to book any activities, you know where your people. All right, guys, love you. Thanks for watching. See you in the next video. We're live, Hillbilly. Ooh, and my Donnie Brewer. If I was really Donnie Brewer, though, my foot would be playing. Yep, my ear would be plucking. Did you know, you ever watch Donnie play? It looks like that. It sounds like it. it sounds more like it. All We're right. live. I know we are. Good evening. Good evening, folks. Where are the detentions? I'm Dan. I'm Chris. Thank you so much for having us. Yeah, absolutely. Down there in Key West. We're up here in Texas. Shh, don't tell anybody. Ooh, I don't think I was supposed to say anything. I apologize. <laughs> Since you guys are down there, you're all around beaches. Beautiful sand, beautiful water, beautiful sky. Beautiful people like Danny Lynn and uh, oh, Danny the original Lynn. hippie chick. Yeah, they're Tiki Man and B Man and I show. I haven't seen Danny Lynn till we got tattoos right here on Danny's lip. Says, KMG, kiss my grits. I said, Danny, you've had two white claws. Let's not get tattoos, but you went and got it anyway. So, <laughs> kiss my grits. <laughs> Welcome to the Key West Bound Songwriter Showcase. Tiki Man Radio, thank you so much for having us once again. Uh, hope everybody's enjoying themselves as much as we are tonight. Mm -hmm. Uh, it's only a Thursday. It's only a Thursday. Here's a little song called Beach in Heaven. Better be a beach in heaven, or I don't think I'll go. Maybe in the Keys, or maybe down in the Lees, or hell, I go for Mexico. I take the surf and the sand and in the promise. Cause if they have a beach in heaven, I'm ready for my halo. Oh, when I die, and the grim reaper comes, I hope he looks like a pirate. Or an old beach bum, if it takes me to them early gates. I want to see Hawaiian shirts and lace As soon as I get my wings I've been looking for just one thing Help us out now Better be a beach in heaven But I don't think I'll go Leave me the keys and maybe down to the leaves Or hey, I go for Mexico I'll take the surf and the sand up in the promised land Cause if they have a beach in heaven, I'm ready for my halo. Let the angels sing, buffet and morning songs. Oh, and serve a land shark beer, margaritas 
all day long. A little cheeky ball would be fun with an endless supply of rum. Just a sipping on that to a show. Lord knows I never asked for more. Better be a beach in heaven. I don't think I'll go. That's a song off of, actually all three of the songs we're going to play today are off of our latest album they released in 2019. Uh, yes, It Is is the title track, or title of that album. And uh, that last song, Beach in Heaven, I wrote with my good buddy Steve McMillan. And uh, we were fortunate enough to run across Eric Darkin of Jimmy Buffett's band, uh, the Coral Reapers. And he was kind enough to say he would play percussion on that track. So yeah, we're very excited. A bit of a brawler, Eric Darkin. We've been in Detroit with him before, and... Uh... I'll tell you what, uh, don't ever do this. Don't ever, like, if you're driving Eric Darkin between the gig and the airport and you stop at a quick shop and get his favorite drink, and everybody knows Eric's favorite drink is Yoo-hoo. a Mountain Dew. Oh, that's you who. No, no, Mountain Dew. You don't shake it up and hand it to him because uh, he's a percussionist and he's good with his hands. So, yeah, I was boxed about the ears. It's the second time I've had a practical joke go south with Eric Darkin. Which is great because uh, he he boxed you about the ears with his feet. Yeah, that's He he, like did this handspring and then and then back on his feet again. It was pretty crazy. He's got the moose. He's got the moose. He does. Well, let's play another song. This is a a song about those that work on the water and those that eagerly await their safe return. It's called Poseidon's Daughter. Uh, for you students of music out there, I just attached something to my guitar called a capo. Or a capo. A capo. Allowing us to play in different voicings. Another secret for you, uh, burgeoning acoustic guitar. Say burgeoning or virgin? Burgeoning. Okay. Same thing, kind of beginning. Okay. Yeah. Uh, make sure that when you're playing and you're not plugged in that your volume is at 50%. Because a little bit more will be a little bit overbearing. A little bit less, he'll totally drown you out. So make sure when you're not plugged in, it's at 50%. Believe me, when it's plugged in, this line goes to another. Yeah. Shh. No, it doesn't. Don't tell Dan that. Yeah, if you push it above 50%, people in the audience will look at you and go, that, that guy's trying a little bit too hard. Mm-hmm. Right? Yeah. Poseidon's daughter. <laughs> Keep 
the heart fires burning bright Time drips slowly, washes over you Dancing with the silence, daughter Punching waterfall on water Chairs empty now, and his pipe and books away. When he's gone, she wonders, did he suffer the sailor's feet? Time drifts slowly and washes over you, dancing with Poseidon's daughter, watching waterfall on water. First mate to the captain, ask more than any man. The rolling waves beneath his feet, more years at sea than at land. Time drifts slowly and washes over you, dancing with my son's daughter, watching water fall on water. Time drifts slowly and washes over you Dancing with Poseidon's daughter Watching water fall on water Water falling on water Ladies and gentlemen, Dan Sullivan, the dulcet sounds, the dulcet tones of Dan Sullivan right there. Hey friends, we are Key West Bound. Thank you so much for uh, letting us come play. Danny Lynn, the original hippie chick, Heather, and uh, B-Man, and Michelle. We miss y'all. Wish we could be there in person, but thank you for allowing, allowing us to be here virtually. Cheers. Raise them high, raise them proud. Rock a mole. We're going to leave you with the title track of our uh, last album. Uh, this was a co-write between me and my daughter. We wrote this on the beach in Port Aransas, Texas, and we're sending all of our love to y'all in Key West from deep in the heart of Texas, Austin, Texas. That's where we are right now. So, uh, That's all I do. Normally this is a sing-along. You have to sing along at your house. We won't be able to hear you, but we'll be able to feel it in our cortisol. Oh, look at that guy. In your cortisol. <laughs> That's Spanish for heart, since we're deep in the heart. Take London or Paris, France. For me, I need to be where my spirit can dance. Cause I'm an easy man with simple needs. I don't care when it wears, give me them. Give me down by the sea, cause I live for the beach. I long for the ocean. It sets my soul free. It's my magic potion. Yes it is, yes it is, yes it is, yes it is. Are right, your turn, sing it for us. Yes it is, yes it is, yes it is, yes it is. That was perfect. I don't care if it's raining or cotton candy in the sky. Either way, every day, I stay there with a smile. Cause I'm an easy man with simple needs. I don't care when it rains. Give me there. Give me down by the sea. I live for the beach, I long for the ocean, it sets my soul free, it's my magic potion, yes it is, yes it is, yes it is, yes it is. Your turn, come on now.
tears on my face Feel the easy, gentle breeze Hear the roar of the waves Cause I'm an easy man with simple needs I don't care where we just get me there Get me there Down by the sea Here we go I live for the beach I long for the ocean It sets my soul free it's bad magic potion. Yes, it is, yes, it is, yes, it is, yes, it is. Yes, it is. Yes, it is. Last time, you go. Yes, it is, yes, it is. All right. I live for the beach. I long for the ocean. It sets my soul, it sets my soul, it sets my soul. Take London or Paris, France. For me, I need to be where my spirit can dance. Thank y'all so much for having us. Tiki Man Radio, B Man Michelle, and Danny Lynn, Heather. Mwah. Love y'all. Have fun, everybody. Kiss my grits. Kiss my grits. Mwah. See it on my lip right there. <laughs> yeah. Woo! Man, I tell you, I love the clapping. That's that's so cool that uh, the detentions, you know, they haven't been doing a whole lot this year, Brian, and, and uh, but it's so nice for them to make time to do this. But now we have the real rock star up here, Patty Campbell. How are you? <laughs> I'm doing great. Yeah, you look great, baby. Uh, yeah, you know, I see you brought Tim along with you. Yeah, I got to drag him around, you know. <laughs> How you doing, buddy? I'm doing good. Man, <laughs> so she uh, keeps me straight. I know that's Absolutely. right. That's all right. That's not an easy. It's not easy being Patty Campbell. I tell you, you know. But nope. Uh, nope. It is what she it keeps is. track of him, though. I've seen that whip she's got for him. <laughs> she has. She has a husband that could choke on a uh, bowl of frosted flakes last night. <laughs> Well, I got to tell you, normally when I see pictures in Key West, I see Donnie Brewer everywhere. I have seen Tim, Tim Campbell, Campbell everywhere, everywhere this week. It's been fantastic. Not in a very good light either. Last night was the turkey suit dancing everywhere. <laughs> well, man, you know, but it looks like, uh, you know, considering all everything that's happened, so many people that are not there, it looks like uh, the crowd that is there is having a good time. Oh, yeah, definitely, man. And, you know, it started all the way up in Cape Coral on Sunday. And we yeah. just been went down through the Keys, and now we're down here uh, busy. We've been with multiple gigs every day, and it's been absolutely fantastic. Man, and then uh, I saw you did a little Jim Morris uh, tribute uh, yesterday. Yeah, I was very privileged to be a part of that with uh, with Andy Forsyth and those guys over at the Smoking Tuna. But yeah. this is fantastic. We got the big stage back here yeah. at Dirty Harry's. Uh, I always come out here when I'm in Key West, and I sit on that perch up top there and watch the bands in the evenings, and yeah. it's just a great venue right here. Well, who knows what the future may bring, you know, there for Dirty Harry's, but we'll see. I, we do like the big stage there. <laughs> so do I. I you think know, I man, know what the I like future. The big stage. <laughs> <laughs> I think I know what the future holds. I do, too. I do, too, but, you know. Uh, we've, been running, but, we've been running into Brian all over town, too. Well, you know, he's a rock star in his own This life. is the most I've played all, you know, the last how many years. We've been stuck at the Tiki House doing our yeah. thing. And yeah. So that's, that's cool, it's good man. to get out, but it's also good to run into this guy and have this guy gracing our stage here at Dirty Harry. Well, you know, Tim and Patty are so much big part of the Sunday show, and those guys came here and hung out with us not too long ago. And we had a Put great a time. We just love these guys. Awesome. I always like to say the only thing I hate about them is they live too far away. Exactly. I think yeah. I'm still recovering from that weekend. <laughs> <laughs> All right. We got about 30 seconds here, Tim. We're going to let you get ready to go play. And uh, we're going to let you go. Thank you so much for being a part of it, buddy. Thank you. All right. Thanks. Wish you were here. Yeah, absolutely. So, All right. Brian, Brian, it uh, looks like you got a big crowd there. We do have a big crowd. We're going to pan the crowd so you can all get a chance to see what we're doing here. All right. Tim's making his way up to the stage. We have Very a lot. Nice. I mean, wow. look at this. Very nice. Now, if I just get everybody to wear a mask and, you know, do social distancing and be careful. I see and some good people yep. there. Look, all right. there's some people wearing them. It's really cool. I mean, we've, we've got a lot going on. And, uh, you know, you can see what's happening. This is, yep. is going to be a good time and good people. Great music going on. And 
Let's go to a commercial. The yeah, and then get ready Michelle. for Tim Campbell. Michelle. There's Michelle. And I want to go back to those times that we had. Having the time of our lives. And do you remember the feeling that? Here's how Tune Designer works. All you got to do is email us your rough song idea, and then we'll make a soundtrack for you. Once you get that soundtrack, you record your vocal, send it back to us, and we'll do a final mix for you, and your song is ready to go. We cover a lot of genres at Tune Designer. We'd love to help you. If you want to know more about what we do, there's a ton of information on our website. There's a lot of videos on our Facebook page. You can see exactly who's going to play your song, and how we do things. We'd love to help you. All right. I want to thank the Tiki Man and uh, for putting on this event, be it virtually or here behind the plexiglass. I want to remind everybody, do not tap on the glass. It scares the artists. There's a young lady from the Surf Rider Foundation here, so I got to sing my song, Saltwater Playground. The second verse is about a little bit of surfing. Now, this is a song I have to do for Danny. Any chance I get to embarrass him for living in Tennessee, I'm going to take it. <laughs> so this one, he lives fairly close to a little place called the 
Brushy Mountain Correctional Facility or something. And there is a song out there that is part of an underserved subject matter when it comes to songwriting, and that's Conjugal Visits. So here's a song about Brushy Mountain and Conjugal Visits. Love you, brother. <laughs> All right. I know a lot of people here have been in a Publix before. And I wonder how many of you have ever been drunk in a Publix before. <laughs> Too many hands go up when I say that. So this song's for you that have ever been drunk in Publix. We hitched the boat to the truck, and I picked up my girl. next song is a it's based on a true story about i was lucky enough to live in the south pacific for a little while on a little island and 
uh, happened to have just so happened I had to walk home one night instead of walking 45 minutes down the road and all the way around to my house I said I bet it's only 20 minutes if I cross the jungle right here and uh three and a half hours later I come out of the jungle and the sun was coming up with my buddy and uh, we were saying jungle drums are like banjos because I'm from near West Virginia so instead of hearing banjos if you hear jungle drums you better start running Like banjos when you hear them in the middle of the night. Your face goes flush, your heart starts beating, and your feet start taking flight. Running like a rabbit through the underbrush, yeah, I think I lost my shoe. It's pitch black dark, I think I'm lost and I don't know what I'm gonna do. A West Virginia boy in the South Pacific, hanging at the tiki bar. Pretty girl, we walked down the beach and I guess we walked too far. My friends thought I scored, they ran off and left me thinking I'd be alright. It wasn't too far to walk even though I didn't even have my flashlight. So I started hooking home, I knew where I was going, I even thought I'd stick a toy cut. I got into the jungle, it got a little thick and I thought it must be nuts. What happened if I tried to move back home? That's when I heard the thump of the drums and realized I wasn't alone. Jungle drums are like banjos when you hear them in the middle of the night. Your face goes flush, your heart starts beating, and your feet start taking flight. Running like a rabbit through the underbrush, yeah, I think I lost my shoe. It's pitch black dark. I'm lost and I don't know what I'm going to do. Another story. Alabama boy hiking through the Congo and they settled in for the night. Everything's good as long as you stay by the camp and the firelight. Made a little something early in the day and he wasn't feeling too good. Went into the jungle and used an excuse that he needed more firewood. Than he should. By the time he was finished, he realized that he must have lost his way. That's when he heard the sound of the log drum beat. He thought this just isn't my day. These jungle drums are like banjos when you hear them in the middle of the night. Your face goes flush, your heart starts beating, and your feet start taking flight. Running like a rabbit through the underbrush, yeah, I think I lost my shoe. And I don't know what I'm gonna do. Yes, yeah, pitch black dark. I think I'm still drunk, and I don't know what I'm gonna do. All right, that's a true story. Now I did get to take part in the uh, the Jim Morris tribute that was over at a, another a venue this yesterday afternoon, and I'm a big uh, big Jim Morris fan. And the more I play his songs, the more I really I keep falling in love with them all over again. And I want to make sure that Jim Morris lives forever by keep playing his songs. And I think that's how we're going to do it. We just keep keep playing those tunes when you're out on your boat or wherever you are. And uh, that'll keep them alive forever in our hearts. This is called Party Dress. What's going to happen now? Is Patty going to dance? Mr. Danny Lynn for having us for the fourth annual, I guess, Tiki Man Singer Songwriter Showcase. So, and we're on TV. All right. So, hopefully, we'll keep this going. I'm going to hit again. Right there on the bayou, down around New Orleans. Throw the biggest. And now back to the headquarters of Tiki Man Radio. The Chocolate Bar Studios in Harrison Bay. Right, looks like a got a big crowd down there. We but, do. Uh, one of our big stars that uh, we truly enjoy uh, a lot of his uh, music and having him here at the Tiki Bar, Mr. Todd Trusty. How you doing, buddy? Good. How you doing, everybody? Man, I'll tell you. You know, just uh, enjoying life. You know, as best we can. You know, this crazy year 
where you've got everybody, uh, you know, kind of just don't know what to do. Brian and I kind of put our heads together and come up with this, and uh, it's going really well, man. We're glad to have you part of it. Oh, thanks for having me. I mean, this is really great. You guys are doing an awesome job. This is really something. Well, I like your wardrobe there. You know, you really got a nice T-shirt there. I really like that. That's oh, yeah. <laughs> I got to give you some more. Yeah, man. So, uh, you know, I've been asking everybody, you know, because, you know, I can't see everybody like I normally do and hug their necks and everything like we are in Key West. But how's things been for you this year, man? Not bad. Not bad. I mean, I mean, I had uh, pretty much a lot of the gigs have kind of dried up, uh, except for, oddly enough, uh, uh, like an every other Sunday gig. Yeah. in all places at Hampton beach. So, and, and the weather was great every week. I was out there every time I was supposed to be there. It worked out great. So and then I did some private gigs here and there, and that's been working out. So it looks like things are starting to ramp back up a little bit here, but then it's kind of questionable. So, yeah. uh, you know, kind of like what Lauren said, you know, I don't do this for a living, so I don't really go out and try to push it that much because there's a lot of guys that are doing this for a living that need the time. That's right. right. That's right. I had I had one guy who, would, you know, he offered up some time and I said, give it to your friends first, because, you know, unless you need somebody to fill in, let me know. Yeah. So, But now I'm kind of getting to that point where, OK, now I'm, I, I don't want to go that long. So let me, let me get back yeah. out. To- yeah. Well, you know, for us and there's a lot of people down in Key West, obviously, you know, right now. And, and uh, but for us, we wanted to give the locals as much of those gigs that they've been waiting for as well, you know, oh, so. Yeah. We just decided to do it this way, and it's worked out really well for us. And uh, we really appreciate you being a part of it. Uh, yeah, yeah, we sent a couple of songs our way this year, you know, when uh, we were on the Sunday show. And uh, so you've been doing a lot of writing? No, I haven't been doing any writing. Uh, there's a guy that came out of the blue, uh, Captain Joe Kent, who is actually literally a towboat captain that, that tug, put, pulls, uh, pushes uh, barges around in Louisiana and Texas. And uh, he's written mo- all those songs that uh, the last four that I've released, and there's more coming. So he's going to round me out. He, he provided me with a bunch of material that I can finish off the CD. So, uh, yeah, that we're, we're trying to get them wrapped up now so that I can get everything out there. But, well, real quickly, we got to let you get ready to play. But uh, I just want you to know, man, we are big fans of yours. Huge fans. And, huge you know, not fans. only do we consider you, a, you know, a friend, but a, we are fans. So we really appreciate you being a part of it. We're going to let you fly because I know you got to hurry and get ready to play. Oh, and congratulations right. on your new house. I love that color, too. Yeah. Uh, awesome. Thank you. Awesome. Thank you. Right. Thank you. Thank you so right, much, folks, brother. Thanks, Todd. Appreciate it. Love you all. Take care. Man, Bye. Brian, you look right at home right there. Let me tell you what. Beach Buddha just brought me one of their coffee uh, whiskey concoctions. Yeah. Oh, nice. <laughs> All right, there we go. Let's go to a quick right. commercial. All right, this first song that I'm going to do is a song that I wrote about a place in Key West that I had not been to up to a certain point. And then friends of mine, when we were down there for me, the mine said, you got to get there. We'll get you there. And the very first night that we got into town, uh, after we had a lot of partying downtown, we took a stroll down to uh, the end of Duval and wound up at Louis' backyard. And what I'd like to say about this song is that uh, when I came back from that trip, I was just finishing up my first CD, Paradise, and this this song just came to me. Uh, But it wasn't finished. I I still had this one little spot left, and I was running into the last day of of the studio. So uh, I was searching online for something to put in there. Uh, Maybe there was something that somebody said about the place that I could kind of twist and bend or whatever. And come to find out, I, I ended up finding a thing on Louis ba- Louis Backyard's website that talked about a dog by the name of Ten Speed. And I have no idea how he got the name Ten Speed, but it talked about this dog that would come by every single day, and they would give it a bowl of Kahlua and cream. It would drink that up and then take off, and it would come back the next day, same time. So. I had to put something in about Ten Speed, so that became the bridge of the song. That really completed it. Got into the studio. We didn't have time to produce anything, so I just said, you know, just hit the record button, let's see what happens, and it ended up on the CD. Uh, we then produced it later and put it, a, a produced version on Souvenirs, which was the second CD. So, this is Louis' Backyard. It's 
good to be back in Key West Escaping life for a while So much to do, so much to see Gives me that Cheshire Cat smile But I need to slow down and decompress Pace the day into the night One more stop, one more bar Will surely set things right Late at night You will find me Far away from Duval Warm gentle breeze And soft crashing waves Takes you away from it all Kicking back with friends and a drink All oh, those stories of the day Chilling on the deck of Louie's backyard Where the world just melts away Soft glow streams from the bar Music drifts on the wind Conversations Fill the air, just how a perfect day ends. And that's why late at night you will find me far away from Duval. Warm, gentle breeze and soft crashing waves takes you away from it all. Kicking back with friends and a drink. Oh, those stories of the day Chilling on the deck of Louie's backyard The world just melts away Ten speed out an ocean I drink every day by the ocean Belly full of cool women cream Lays on the beach and dream Party's almost over Back to the real world I'll go This Duval crawl must come to an end There's one more stop so let's go Last night and you will find me Far away from Duval Warm gentle breeze Soft crashing waves Takes you away from it all Kicking back With friends and a drink All those stories of the day Chilling on the deck Of Louie's backyard The world just melts away Chilling on the deck Of Louie's backyard The world just melts away That's Louie's Backyard. This next song I'm going to do is one that I've got, I'm going to give you three little tidbits about this one. Yeah, a couple of them, well, at least one of them, nobody really knows. So when I wrote this song, it actually started out as a speaking song. So if you remember the song of uh, Sean Mullen's Rockabye, he does, it's all talking, and then he gets to the chorus and he sings. So Old New England was actually written that way. You know, it started that way. But it didn't really test out too well to people that I ran it by, so I kind of made some tweaks and changes. It was a little long anyways. And so, yeah, it used to be, it used to actually go like this. Snow began to fall. In this New England town. Bobby said, hell no, I ain't sticking around. So yeah, that's kind of how it started. But uh, not too many people know that, except for the people that actually heard me try to do that one version. So 
I tweaked it a little bit, obviously, and turned it into just more of a song. So the other thing I want to point out is that the woman who is the background singer on that, her name is Brenda Furtado. She actually went to the studio, and every single time you hear her voice, there are three different tracks. So by the time she got done that night, she recorded 96 tracks, I believe, maybe 96 tracks. I mean, that's a lot to be singing that night, but um, it was incredible to watch her work with Bob Catalano, the guy running the studio. Uh, it was just, it was, it was, it was wild. He, Bob would be like, okay, do this, and she would just do it. And um, so it was really cool. So that's, that's another tidbit. And then the other thing, uh, most recently, that uh, Andy Forsythe, uh, many of you may know Andy uh, from Beachfront Radio. He's actually uh, putting together a CD of songs about pickleball, the game pickleball, which I don't really know much about. But I was flattered that Andy asked me to take Old New England and turn it into a pickleball song. And he came up with the words for it. So I went back, did, redid the vocals for it. And uh, all the musicians there are putting their songs with pickleball words uh, onto the CD. Uh, the sales are going to benefit, I believe, um, the Tampa Bay Shriners. So if you get a chance, check it out. That would be really cool. All right, so here is Old New England's typical song about uh, getting out of the cold and never coming back. Snow began to fall on this New England town. Bobby says he'll know. I ain't sticking around. He hops on a flight to someplace warm. Got up just in time before the door used to storm. Now he sits on the beach all day in that hot island sun. Thinking about his home back in New England. The Bob finds his cash is running low. He gets a job at the beach bar to keep him afloat. A lovely native girl catches his eye. Oh, she played it well, acting so shy. Now he works on the beach all day in that high. Island sun, thinking about his girl while the servant runs. Now he loves the life he leads in that hot island sun. Bobby never dreams of going back to New England. Now Bobby sings to the tourists down on the beach Spinning musical tales of how their dreams are in reach He laughs when he thinks what might have been Had he never hopped that flight out of New England Now he sings on the beach all day in that high Island sun, think about his life and what it's become. Yeah, he's living in a paradise, soaking up that sun. He raises a toast to old New England, having fun in the sun, drinking rum. Not in New England Raise them up To old New England A little sound note there Alright, so I'm trying to move this along I apologize for kind of It seems like I'm kind of speeding it up But uh, this next one I, 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 I've met a guy by the name of Captain Joe Kent uh, He found me on Facebook We started up a conversation And come to find out that uh, Captain Joe uh, You might also hear him refer to as Towboat Joe uh, He is a true captain He's out there uh, moving goods And pushing barges around the Louisiana And Texas waterways And uh, Joe if you're watching How you doing bud 
uh, stay safe out there. And um, yeah, so Joe uh, opened up his catalog of a lot of songs. Uh, we know he, he's out there on these long journeys, out there weeks at a time, and writing songs while he's in the uh, wheelhouse. And um, so yeah, we uh, we've got a bunch of songs put together, and I'm I'm actually the, the CD should be coming out soon. Soon, I hope. Just trying to wrap a few little details up, and then we'll have something out there. But this is actually this is one of the songs that came off of one of the first ones that I heard from him. And Joe likes to play on words sometimes, so you know the proverbial "you know what hits the fan." Well, this is when the ship hits the sand. Deep uncharted waters on this course I'm on. Wondered if I'm right or if I'm wrong. I'm up against a head tide, no one to call my friend. And it's all smooth sailing till the ship hits the sand. There are no beacons to guide you through the rain But the storms keep on surging just the same I wonder if I'll ever see home for again And it's all smooth sailing Till the ship hits the sand well, I've been aground a time or two in I was scared to move with a heavy list of not knowing what to do. Here comes that sinking feeling once again. It's all smooth sailing till the ship hits the sand. A captain has to do much more than try. If I don't succeed, it means our lives. So I'm asking for the good Lord's guiding hand Cause it's all smooth sailing Till the ship hits the sand Well I've been aground a time or two In places I was scared to move With a heavy list of not knowing what to do Here comes that sinking feeling once again it's all smooth sailing till the ship hits the sand. There you go, that's when the ship hits the sand, written by Captain Joe Kent. Alright, well that does it for me folks, thank you so much. Uh, for my friends who are down there in Key West, stay safe, have fun. Tiki Man, thank you so much. Hippie Chick, miss you guys. Uh, Brian Fields, thanks for putting this together. And I, I'm excited to be a part of this, even if it's virtually. Uh, it's, it's such a great event and I look forward to seeing everybody else. Everybody stay safe, have a great time, happy Halloween, and take care. Bye. And now back to the headquarters of Tiki Man Radio, the Chocolate Bar Studios in Harrison Bay. All right, man, I hope you were enjoying uh, Todd Trusty. I know we had a great time when he we came did. here to the uh, Chocolate Bar and hung out with us, but one of our favorites is here with us right now, Marty Nickel. How you doing, buddy? Good. How you guys doing? Hey. Yeah. Hey, doing... Marty. <laughs> hey. How you well, doing? Well, we're not, not in good. Key West, but uh, Brian is, obviously. He's down there gloating on all this is going on. But, uh, <laughs> yeah, really. <laughs> you're down in Amelia Island. We're here in the uh, Chocolate Bar Studios. And uh, 
One of the things I wanted to tell everybody out there, first of all, if you're watching this on YouTube, please go subscribe. Go to TGMedRadio.com. And if you're watching on YouTube right now, just go ahead and subscribe. But I wanted Marty to know that Marty is one of the few artists that goes way back to the Tiki Bar days here before radio. And we used to play Tiki Time uh, long before we got into yeah. radio and, and you have always been one of my uh, special artists that, uh, I dearly love, man. I, I really appreciate everything you do. Hey, thanks. Thanks, Danny. Thank you guys play me off and on. I love that. And you know, it's, it's great to uh, just listen to the, to the good tropical music. <laughs> well, you know, I mean, I always kind of describe people that, uh, you know, you kind of fly under the radar and, and I don't, you know, I know it's by choice a lot of times that, uh, you're not like on a tour bus going around the country, but uh, no. <laughs> I, I also know that, uh, you know, once people turn on to your music, they're like, holy crap, where's this guy been? I'm like, he's always been there. Been you there. just ain't been paying attention. <laughs> he's awesome. In the clouds, yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so how you been handling uh, this whole pandemic this year? I know you did a lot of live uh, stuff because we were tuned into it a lot. And uh, Yeah, so I did a summer, summer yeah, live Facebook and probably do a, probably do a, a late fall winter one. Yeah. Um, but you know, if we're playing out, not, not much right now for me, been doing some sporadic recording and, um, mm-hmm. writing some songs here and there. <laughs> well, I always tell people that, uh, you've probably got two CDs in your head right now. You know, it's just a matter of getting them done, you know, cause you, you're always writing, you're always thinking. And, uh, I suspect that's, that's, that's where you're at right now. Yeah. You know, a, um, I'm kind of doing some remote recording through uh, Reveal Audio Studios up in Atlanta, and we're doing it all kind of like this. It's just crazy yeah. the way it works. So uh. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, you know, I mean, with the whole the way the world has went, and uh, you know, Brian and I kind of sat down in April and kind of decided what can we do that's going to be different from everybody else and make keep everybody safe at the same time. And this is what we came up with, and I'll tell you, we're having a lot Great of fun idea. with it. Yeah, yeah, great it's idea. Been fun. Yeah, <laughs> it's great. Brian, Brian's got a jam-packed uh, place down there. This place is going crazy. Oh my yeah. god. Yeah. <laughs> I'm serious. I didn't know it was going to be really this packed, but we got a lot of people down here, and they're waiting for you, Marty. They can't wait to see you. We have a TV oh, on in the dude. back. <laughs> yeah, that's right. That's, that's right. Fantastic. <laughs> <laughs> uh, but yeah, truly one of our highlights, or my personally highlight, long even before Hippie Chick and I got together. Uh, when we used to have tiki bar parties and stuff with playing tiki time and it was nice that she was here and be able to uh, share it with me when you came and played the tiki bar that was fantastic that was man oh, that was great enjoyed that, that a lot like get up there again one of these days <laughs> we've well, got a new stage uh, yeah now. i it's saw permanent. it looked beautiful yeah, yeah. oh it's you. it's really cool but we got a few seconds here time is such precious on this whole thing man i just want to thank you personally and we're going to let you get ready to uh, uh go get ready to play for all these crazy people watching you around the world yeah i can't wait to play for him <laughs> all right look forward to seeing you marty all righty thank 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 thanks guys. brother thank we appreciate, you. It. appreciate it bye-bye hey bye. i'm pr- i'm proud of this next commercial because oh, i put yeah? this next i put this commercial together well, you're the hardest working person in showbiz. There's no doubt about it. Well, I do my best, you know. It's, <laughs> it, it, it's all for a good cause. You know, we've got a good raffle going on here. Surf riders have been raffling like crazy. Love so, those guys. You know, and hey, if you're in Key West, you need to get your nails done at Nail Teeny. That's right. right. Hi, I'm Sissy, owner of Nail Teeny Nail Bar and Day Spa, located at 817 Duval Street. Nail Teeny is an amazing place to come. It's always fun. We believe in perfection, and overall, it's just a great experience. We offer skincare, facials, waxing, and we're also partnered with Key West Institute for Plastic Surgery. So Botox and fillers are available by appointment. You should make your appointment today. You can call 305-294-4443 or you can visit my website at nailteenykeywest.com. When you want to get nailed in Key West, there's only one place you can go. Nail Teeny Nail Bar and Day Spa at 817 Duval Street. Hey, this is Marty Nichol 
want to thank uh, Tiki Man Radio for putting on this show of uh, songwriters. Appreciate being a part of it. And um, big thanks to Tiki Man Radio for supporting uh, Coastal Americana Music and their artists all these years. So uh, thanks again to Tiki Man Radio. I want to do a, a new song for you here. Uh, with the COVID crisis going on, um, I think everybody's ready for some changes, hopefully sooner than later. So uh, there's a new song I wrote. This is called Waiting for the Tides to Change. Picture on my wall of a Maryland blue crab over my head spins the ceiling fan. I feel like a starfish trapped in a sea pool in the sand, waiting, waiting, waiting for the tide. here uh, so it's available for purchase in fact uh, all my songs you can uh, you can uh, buy on iTunes Apple Music Amazon Spotify all those uh, media places uh, so uh, check that out and if, if you want to check my website out it's martinnickel.com uh, no new dates right now because of the COVID crisis but uh, hopefully that that will change in the near future and uh, check my uh, Facebook page out, Marty Nickel Music. I hope to be doing some fall, winter live Facebook shows. I did a summer, summer uh, live Facebook. I'm going to do some uh, fall, winter stuff. So look for that. But again, uh, thanks to Tiki Man Radio. And uh, speaking of Tiki's, I'm going to do you this song. I uh, used to live up in Atlanta. I had a good friend who uh, had a little pool in his backyard. He built this really nice tiki bar. And every May or April, uh, we would open it up, uh, turn on the lights with the live uh, music we turn on. And uh, summer was officially here. And uh, it was always a good feeling to know that uh, 
When the tiki bar was open, summer was here. So, uh, a little song called Tiki Time. <laughs> Turn on a mute, turn on a party light. Somebody plug in a blender. Where's that bag of ice? Winter is over. Kiss it goodbye. Summer's here. Tiki time. Somebody jumped in the pool, <laughs> did a big old cannonball, got everybody soaking wet, sitting at the tiki bar, but nobody cared, everyone was feeling fine, summer's here. We got margaritas, mojitas, we got mud slides too, we got a little bit of wine, and a whole lot of brew, oh yeah, all right, summer's here, tiki time, we got a little James Hunter, Played on a stereo Somebody at a tiki bar Broke out the domino No sign of rain Clear sailing skies Summer's here And it's tiki time Here we are in the chocolate bar studios. Brian, how you doing down there, buddy? Man, I'm having a blast. There are so many people. I keep saying that, but there are. I, some leave and they, and they come back in droves. So we're having a great time. Well, all <laughs> right. So we got, uh, let's see here. Uh, I'm excited. Uh, yeah. I'm excited about this. Yeah. This this next one. I mean, it's who, awesome. Who is this guy? I, I don't even know if I know his name. Who is it coming up? Uh, Keith Sykes? Well, Keith Sykes, this guy has done so much stuff for us over the years. He left a Yoko Ono tribute to come hang out with Michelle and I in Memphis. Oh, wow. That's, I was that's like, fantastic. what? Yeah, yeah. no, it's, it's been awesome. Well, Keith could not be uh, in the interview, but we have a special treat here. I'm going to kind of pan the camera around well, there. Well, he's, he's actually getting ready in his ardent studios. There yeah, in Memphis. yeah, yeah. Well, he, yeah, he says, uh, I'm going to need a little extra time. I'm like, we're good. We're good. So. But we got Ed, the train man, here in the Chocolate Bar Studios right now. Yeah, and, yeah. Uh, hey, how you doing? Man, you know, Brian and I wanted to make sure that we had an opportunity to thank you for all the hard work that you and Pat have done over the last couple of years, and especially getting ready for this uh, major television premiere that's bigger than Elvis in Hawaii. Oh, man, you're so welcome. You know, we just love being a part of all this. You know, Pat taking the photos, of course, doing her books, and yeah. and then me trying to get all the videos from uh, all the fans, and they've loved it. They, I, I've had so so much fun interacting with all these different folks getting their videos in it's been a lot of fun it's been a fun well it's, it, we really it's a appreciate lot of work. it and, oh, it and, is a lot of work and, and i gotta tell you from my perspective on this end 
I can't tell you how much I appreciate all the hard work that you've done, all the back end, getting the videos, getting, you know, people involved with this so that we could advertise. I couldn't have done it myself. So thank you. You're so welcome. And, you know, I, I, I have, it's, it's, it's easy. It, all these fans made it so much easier for me because all I did was ask, you know, all these people and they were more than willing. They were so excited about getting these videos out to you. That's yeah. cool. That's cool. I mean, everybody, uh, we were thinking about that earlier when we were looking at everything and how things were going today. It's like so, everybody's so willing to just be a part of this. It's really cool. Yes, they are. Yes, they are. And uh, I tell you what, that, that Chris Ferrara down there too, he's excited about being a part of this too. <laughs> well, there you go. <laughs> well, you know, I hear we're up for a really big awards, like an Emmy for this production. I think so. This, this is so cool. I, I can't tell you how cool this is. <laughs> Yeah, in case y'all are wondering, I'm in a little picture picture. You can kind of see me going back and forth there. There we go. Well, I, hey, I'm playing with my splitter too. Oh yeah, yeah. yeah. We've learned out. We've got all kinds of cool toys that uh, we've yeah. had to learn how to play with here with the uh, the, the studio and everything. But uh, Brian's got a big crowd down there at, at Dirty Harry's and Rick's, and uh, man, we've got a great crowd here at the Chocolate Bar. Oh yeah. It's going great here too, yeah. Yeah. Now, who was it you guys brought down with you? Debbie and Bob. Debbie, Debbie and Bob. Bob. Yeah, they're. Oh, they, here they, they are. They were. Uh, yeah. They were, they were down the, in Nashville. Uh, the they came. Yeah. yeah, they came down to see the chocolate bar and the world famous tiki bar. You yeah. know, and uh, they're having a great time. All right. Well, we're gonna get we're gonna get ready to uh, go to uh, Keith Sykes here in just a few seconds. But we uh, we love you guys. We you know everything you guys have always done for us. We really appreciate it. Uh, you know, we uh, volunteering for everything that uh, you guys do. You want something to go right, you better hire a train man. That's, That's all right. I say. That's right. Yeah, we're, well, we're, and, I tell you. And this next commercial is about recycling. And I got to thank you. When you guys come down here, you go plogging with us on Key West, helping us keep this island clean, you know, for our kids, for the future, for everything. So I got to thank you a million times over for being a part of that with us. Yeah. Oh, that's that's another thing we like to be a part of. We enjoy that as well. Thank you, Brian. All right. Fantastic. We got, we got about five seconds here. We're going to go to that commercial. Brian, I'll see you on the flip side, buddy. See you, buddy. All right, guys. Aww. Are you trying to be a responsible citizen and the best recycler you can be, but you just aren't sure what goes where? Well, browse on over to keywestrecycles.com and check out our solid waste toolbar. You will find helpful tools like our waste wizard that helps you decide how to dispose of an item, a waste sorting game that is great practice for recycling and fun. You can also check out your pickup schedule, sign up for reminders, and access our need help tool. You can be the captain of your own sustainability. Captain Bobby, sitting all alone, corner of the bar, just minding his own. Young tourist, a tickle in the bone. Dressed and not up, but down, and pick up the down. Watching all the girls as they walk in the around. Fella, 
walks up to the band and slips the Ben Franklin in the lead singer's hand. Says he's a writer and he's got some good lines. He'd love for them to listen if they get a little time. They pull him up off the floor right in front of the crowd. Pulling along as he belts out loud. Hey, they come from far and near for the butterfly shrimp and the ice cold beer. Hey, it's always nice, a little place chilling in paradise. Hey, it's a real good time, only thing you can't do is sit around and unwind. Hey, everybody is a Sometimes you run off like I'm stinking and build me a bar in the back of my car and drive myself to drinking. I'm gonna drive myself to drinking and I won't have to go nowhere cause any place I wanna go I'll be already there Oh, my eyes will shine like red tail lights On my brand new hopped up Lincoln I'll Build me a bar in the back of my car And drive myself to drinking Gonna build me a bar in the back of my car and drive myself to drinking. And now back to the Chocolate Bar Studios in beautiful Harrison Bay. 
Brian, I cannot believe that Keith Sykes made time to do this, man. It's just unbelievable, and what a great job he's been doing, man. Hey, he's, a, he's a good friend, I'll tell you. Yeah. I love that guy to death, and uh, for him to do this and take time out for us, it was awesome. So, hey, we got Rick Lamb here. Rick oh, Lamb is there, man. Thank you so much, man, for being a part of this. You got you came down last year and did it live at the Tiki House, which is just crazy. Yes, it uh, was. Cool. Uh, and uh, we're very, very fortunate to have you be a part again of it this year, man. Thank you so much for that. It's an honor for me to be here with you guys. Trust me. Well, so uh, everybody's been doing something different this year, trying to make our way through this crazy year. How's things been going with you, man? Well, I, I don't even have one of my band members here with me, but I got a band. So there, that that's, that tells you how it is. Well, we've been kind of watching from afar, you know, this year. So uh, I've seen a lot of pictures of you out there having a good time. Looks like uh, the crowds are a little smaller, but it looks like you've been able to really enjoy yourself. Well, yeah, in Missouri, if you saw a lot of the photos and stuff that went on during COVID, we were pretty wide open, and, and I play those lakes that you saw on the news, trust me, yeah. quite yeah. a bit, and there's big crowds. So yeah. I've been fortunate and doing everything I can to stay safe and making sure everybody else is too. So, Good. Well, this is kind of a, a unique thing that Brian, and uh, it's really Brian's idea, and, and we kicked it around. It's like, hey, you know, what can we do differently? And, and this was the next step to try to uh, figure out a way to keep the music of you guys, you know, cause that's really what we all do right here at Tiki Med Radio is to make sure that you guys music is out there and people can see it, hear it. And uh, this is really cool, man. It is. And it's good that we could be here. It was, it was kind of questionable, wasn't it? Yeah. Yes. Yeah. A long was. time. Yeah. Yeah. We, well, you know, for us, you know, once we, uh, once uh, uh, meeting in the minds, the actual event was canceled, uh, and you got, you know, with this whole year, you got it. You cannot think hardly past two weeks, much less six no. months. But there's so much that goes into what we do behind the scenes that, uh, you know, it takes so much planning. We had to make a decision. And uh, I feel like it was the right decision to make because we're able to be in Key West and we're able to uh, be here in the chocolate bar and have you guys on us as well, you know. Oh, yeah. This is really neat. This is going to be cool. Of course, the hippie chick wants to say hello to you. Well, Hi. good morning. Actually, good afternoon, I think, now. <laughs> yeah, I think it is. It's afternoon. Yeah. How many I beers so. now? That's right. That's right. Well, man, we just want to get you on real quick. We know you've got to get ready to play. We just wanted to thank you so thank much for you. being a part of it this year, okay? That's great. I've got a new CD coming out, first of the year. It was supposed to be done by now, but yeah. times are what they are, and I couldn't get it done. So oh, fantastic. Yeah. Make sure you get that to the radio station. We'll get you on for the Sunday show to talk about it, okay? It's going to be a solo one. It's going to be me. It's not the band. Hey, that's, that's fine. That's, that's what amazing. I like. You know, it's All good, right. man. So, Thanks, brother. We'll let you fly Thank and get you. ready to play. Lots of love, you guys. Thanks, Thank man. you so much, Rick. Appreciate it. Yeah. All right. Here's what's going on here at Rick's. Check out how busy this place is. Nice. Look at that. Donald Lee Carpenter. Yeah. <laughs> they, all, they all came to see Rick. <laughs> yeah. Nice. Nice. They all came. Yep. Yeah, so Rick's heading up there. He's going to get ready to play here. Here's what the crowd looks like. Here's my ugly mug. <laughs> <laughs> well, all righty then. <laughs> all right, take it away. All right. I created Tune Designer for everyday, ordinary people who want to put out their own music, but they want it to sound amazing, something that they can be proud of. And we've made it so easy for you. You don't even have to leave home when you work with us. Um, if you've ever tried to record a song yourself, it can be really stressful finding the right musicians, finding a recording studio, booking the time, getting all the schedules right so that everybody can do it for you. And after all that time and energy, sometimes you still don't get the result that you want. And so we wanted to make it really easy for you to work with us. And so we'd love to help you. There's tons of videos on our Facebook page where you see exactly who would play your song exactly how we would approach it uh, i would encourage you to watch any of those videos we'd love to help you hi brian oh how y'all doing it's great to be here it's great to be part of tiki man radio i'm honored and i uh, got to do this last year that's kind of where we met everybody and so that's why i'm back again and i should be back next year i believe so i never give up my name is Ricky Lamb, and I'm uh, from the Springfield, Missouri area. And uh, we've got a drove down here with that crazy caravan with the keys to the roof in North Camden. And I'm going to just hop chocolate. How's that? Mm -hmm. 
Quisiera pues disfrutar en tu buena Ándale a tu perfil en Moreva Watch the sun rise on the horizon Take it long, take it long. 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 Isn't that true? Huh? No. Say it long, say it long. I don't tell them no doubt, no tell them vision. Catch the pool, I lose the evening vision. Watch the sun set on the horizon. Say it long, say it long. Got the stars, you got me through the dark night. I'll be standing in the shadow of the moonlight. Watch the sunrise on the horizon. Say long, say long. I was made for the ocean. You know the ocean was made for me. Life is complicated. Well, song like the first CD ever, and uh, yeah, I like to I talk about sailing. I was a Navy boy for a lot of years, and seen a lot of ports and everything, so it's kind of what I like to do. No, I'm searching for paradise. Softy peaks of land on the edge of somewhere. Escape the madness of city life. Ooh, it gets crazy. Lay around in the sand. Cause I find the sea of sand. Say, change your way of life. Under tropical skies. Say, change your way of life. Under tropical skies. this song a little bit this weekend, but hope you all appreciate that uh, 
We love coming down to the Keys, and I'm sure there's nine million songs that you'll hear on this uh, little end of the world here about being down in the Keys, but this one's mine. So back on the coast. <laughs> Go back in time to the time in the Navy when I was uh, taking little trips out across the sea and, uh, to the Mediterranean. They called it a med cruise. We'll 
double drop D. This is all true stories. I was very fortunate. I did six pet cruises there, all about seven to nine months long. Got to see the whole world over there. It wasn't a vacation. Join the Navy, the slogan was, it's not just a job, but it's an adventure. But it's a lot of work, trust me. We'll see how the words are changed here. Bring the dog, gonna get out of the way. Shit, sit and say a lot of more people. Get excited at the Florida Keys, chart a new course for the open sea. Hang your top that in the new day song, hurricane season in the Caribbean. Working all night to a tropical fall, got me going feeling like I've been feeling all along. Yeah, we got a whole plane and there's a swap. The Navy's not a thing, it's just a job. Yeah, we come from the land of the free, sailing around the world to bend our country. Rick Lamp tearing it up on stage down in Key West. How about Cheek Man Radio, everybody? All right, Hey, we'd like to hear that in the background. So, Bill, <laughs> you've been part of the Tiki Man Radio Songwriter Showcase every year and uh, four years, man. This is, this awesome. is This is really cool, man. And I remember the first year you played. Yeah, that's been awesome. I can't uh, thank you and Brian enough for that, you know? Wow, what is that? What is that coming into the picture there? What, what was that? A little beautiful what was that? fun crawling. Little, oh yeah, a little <laughs> little parrot there. <laughs> so how you been doing, man? Well, been doing great, man. Knock on wood, we're all doing great here. Uh, yeah, had a really busy summer, uh, but you know we're carrying on, and things uh, dried up for a while, like everyone else is saying. But mm -hmm. you know, um, I was able to get a new single uh, completed and released. That's uh, that's right. So got that done. And then uh, a little bit after that started, uh, went back in the studio and started on a new song. And we're still working on that one. We're almost done, but uh, yeah. we should be able to wrap it up, I think, maybe in about another uh, month, I think, for a January release. Something really different this time around. Well, you've always been really kind to Tiki Man Radio, and and uh, we love you to be a part of the Sunday show and the Tiki Man Radio Songwriter Showcase. And I, I, you know, we kind of go all the way back to that first year at the Tiki House, and uh, we all didn't know what we were doing at the time. We we had an idea of where we wanted to take this thing, but who knew we'd be like, uh, you know, streaming on TV life. around the world. <laughs> no, this is crazy. You know, and I, I, I can remember every one of those Tiki Man uh, songwriter showcases down there, right yeah. from the very first one when I met Brian and uh, got involved, and it's it's been a great ride. And this is this is wacky, but it's a lot of fun too. We've been watching all day. Yeah. Oh, people are watching all around the world on YouTube. We're streaming live on YouTube. And if you are watching us on YouTube, make sure you take out your phone, go over there and subscribe or whatever. And uh, we got to keep growing this. So when we get back to Key West next year and Bill Crowley's playing at the uh, whatever stage we're at, uh, you know, they can always be streaming it on YouTube yeah, as well. Live. Yeah, man. Sounds good to me. I, I really can't thank you guys enough for keeping me included in it and uh, letting letting me grow with the the show. And I sure hope if there's a spot next year, I'm I'm all in. 
Well, you know, I'm one of the rare people. I don't know. Maybe there's people out there, but you know, all through the bar here, there are the beautiful Sean Crawley bumper stickers <laughs> and, uh, you know, people come here and they like, Hey, I want to get a cup of coffee. I want to get some beach Buddha coffee. And they go up and they get a cup and it's like, is that Bill Crowley? I'm like, yes, it yes, is. It is. <laughs> <laughs> I actually did the show one Sunday with my Bill Crowley uh, t-shirt. Up. Yes. Oh, man. Yeah. I think you sent me a picture of that. You guys have been, you guys have been good to me, you know, right from the get go. Uh, you, you've really, uh, I really are responsible for giving me a big boost in my, in my trap rock short career that it's been and um I, I don't think i'd be anywhere near where i am now if it wasn't for you guys i really do appreciate it a lot well we appreciate that look michelle. at there we got the beautiful michelle there michelle right look at her look at yeah you. absolutely you know yeah hey michelle <laughs> <laughs> But uh, so, Bill, uh, we got about uh, 55 seconds here or so, though, and then we're going to let you get on stage and get ready to play. Uh, you know, anything uh, new that you need to announce in the next 10 seconds? <laughs> um, I don't know. I'm about to finish. Uh, I hope people will still enjoy my current single out there now called Florida Junkie. I'm about yeah. to finish uh, my next song. It's called Ain't No Way to Live. Actually, gonna, oh. I'm going to play it so people can hear it. Okay, um, good deal. And I sure hope with that, uh, that's well received when that comes out. It's going to be something really different than anything I've done prior to this. So yeah. um, it's a song I've had for a little while. It gets a great reception when I do it live. And uh, I'm really curious to see now how the uh, how the reception will be among the Trop Rock crowd, you know. Well, all right, so, man. We're going to let you in January. Yes. All right. We're going to let you get on stage and get ready to play, man. Thank, Thank you so you, much, Bill. brother. See you, Bill, from Key West. Thank you guys so much. Thanks, brother. All right, man. Talk All to right. you later. Hi, it's Amber from Key West Finest, your personal concierge. I'm out here on SV Aria, one of our preferred charters, and we'd love to get you out here too. So message us on Key West Finest right here on Facebook, and we will work with you as your personal concierge because we're the experts on getting out on the water and in the water in Key West. Enjoy your day. I know I will. Hey, everybody. This is Bill Crowley here, the original Florida junkie, coming to you from my house here in Fort Lauderdale, Florida. I would uh, rather be in Key West, you know, but we're playing it extra safe, sticking close to home. I want to first of all thank Danny Lynn and Brian Fields for including me in this year's Kiki Man Radio Songwriter Showcase, Key West Bound. Thank you guys. Do have a couple uh, close family members here that are in the house offering a little support, making it a little, make it a little more festive today. All right, let's kick things off with my current single. This is called Florida Junkie. So many vices, it's difficult to choose. Sometimes you win, sometimes you lose. Living by the ocean is my favorite house. Where I'll be till the day I die Cause I'm a Florida junkie I love a coast to coast If it's old and funky That's what I like most So give me all your sunshine I'll take all that 
Somewhere in the keys That's all the junkie song this is another song I wrote called time flies when you're having sun it was another fun vacation all the way to say somewhere they had the lovely sights and the steamy nights still there's something that don't seem fair
Fourth annual Tiki Man Songwriter Showcase, Key West Bound. Here we are, October 31st, Halloween day. What could possibly go wrong? <laughs> this won't go wrong. This is a song I wrote a little while ago about a world traveler in our family. And this is called Wherever We Please. in the studio or as we speak and this is called Ain't No Way to Live Something's gotta give 
Showcase Key West Bound. We'll see y'all later. Bye bye. And now back to the Chocolate Bar Studios in beautiful Harrison Bay. Man, Bill Crawley been part of it every year, Brian, and uh, just tearing it up there uh, awesome. and having yes. a good time, right? He he does, man. He's 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 awesome. He does a really great job for us. And uh, four years in a row, four years. I know that's it's crazy. Awesome. It's crazy. But all the way to San Diego, we have Mr. <laughs> Jerry Gontain. How you doing, brother? Hey, I'm Tippy Tappy with a song in my heart, and thanks for asking. Oh, man. I, you know, we were talking a little bit while you were in the green room there that uh, it's such an honor to have you be a part of this. And and uh, we have big big fans of yours for a long time. And just just to know when Brian said, hey, I got Jerry, he's going to be part of it, I was like, yes, yes. So thank you so much. Oh, you're welcome. You know, I, I have a history with these, those guys. We uh, going back to the days of Biff and Bubble parties at, uh, with the uh, <laughs> Albuquerque <laughs> Parrothead Club. <laughs> the New there Mexico Parrothead Club. <laughs> so it was fun. It's always been fun. Hey, well, hey, thank you guys for doing what you're doing, especially for the Surfrider Foundation. Um, yeah. I've done several benefits out here in San Diego uh, yeah. with working with uh, Surfrider and, and getting money up for them. So kudos to you. Thanks very much for doing that. Those guys, yeah, those guys have been so good to work with and they're very uh, involved, you know, like it's not just like the charity that we're raising money for. They show up and they participate and they have a great time. Yes, they do. Yeah, I know. Yeah, Um, they're they're really good people to to work with down here. We love them. That's why they're back every year. Yeah, absolutely. I I got to thinking about this earlier. There's a you're you're there when this is supposed to be meeting of the minds week, right? That's right. Yeah, exactly. Event. You know, there's a, there's several events down there. There's that Zonta walk that didn't have Zonta. music before, and Mike Broward and I um, started playing there. I thought they were going to have live bands, so I asked if we could play, and she goes, "Well, we don't have music." And I said, "Well, we'll come play for you." <laughs> you do now. <laughs> and then there was the goodie bag stuffing party. They used to stuff bags, uh, listening to. Um, Jimmy Buffett CDs and I said well why don't you guys have live music and so the next year 
um, I got my I got a guitar and um, one of the guys from uh, St. Mini someplace or St. Mini somewhere uh, was supposed to come out and play with me and he never showed. So I grabbed two musicians who were walking by and we became the band that played for the goodie bag stuffing party. Oh, that's awesome. <laughs> that's so cool. Like you know, said, we, we've got a history here. It's been going since like 1999. Well, Mike uh, lives about an hour and 40 minutes from my house here in Tennessee outside of Nashville or so. So I kind of yeah. keep up with him a little bit, you know, so that's kind of cool. Uh, you know, but uh, this this deal with uh, uh, everybody doing Zoom meetings and concerts and stuff, I know you've been kind of watching all that stuff and, and you kind of got into that before all this happened. Uh, and it, it seems to like uh, kind of caught on to everybody. Well, Facebook Live, thank you for very much for putting it out there for us. Uh, I mean, that, right. that really got things going. And then it just, like I said, the floodgates opened up and, yeah. and now everybody's uh, doing it. And I mean, you know, when you're going from playing from four to five days a week uh, down to nothing, and the only way that you've got to get any kind of music out there or get your face in front of people is to stream live. Well, you got to go right. where the flow is. Well, this particular year, you know, it's it's kind of one of those things, you know, uh, it, it has made everybody think outside the box. And, right. uh, you know, working with Brian, as long as he and I work together, you know, this is this come out to be the perfect thing for us to do. And we want to thank you. I know you got to get ready to play for us, but uh, we've got about thank 20 so seconds here. Thank you so much for being a part of this. And, and I hear you're going to do a Hugo song. Yep. Yeah, hey, I love thanks, it. You guys. Thanks for having me. I appreciate it. And, and uh Keep up the good work. You're doing an excellent job. Thank you As so you, much, Jerry. Same to you, buddy. You're welcome. Thanks, Thank buddy. You. All right. See you soon. All right. Here we go. Here we go. Oops. Take it away, mister. <laughs> <laughs> Sipping your cup of coffee down by the waterline. Feet in the water, an old beach chair, you're doing fine. A new day lies ahead, take a moment to clear your mind. Beach Buddha coffee, a fresh cup of island time. Beach Buddha coffee, the best roast from coast to coast. celebrated my uh, 21st anniversary of being married to my Shannon. So here's a love song in, uh, in the first person. What are you doing to my heart? What are you doing to this lonely man? Tried so hard to play it smart. What are you doing to my heart? Uh -huh. This ain't the first time that I fell I've been knocked down and got up again And I got stories to tell This ain't the first time that I fell Oh no Seems my luck has finally turned I found someone that makes me burn Makes me laugh, she makes me yearn Tried my best to play it cool in your arms I found a wonder world You sent this old boy back to school I tried my best to keep it cool Oh yeah I gave my best, you made me shine Keep the ghosts away at night You know my heart, you ease my mind I may 
not be the only one Who looks your way and wants you by his side If you offer me the keys We'll spend our time on an amazing ride Oh yeah Felt your heart beat through the night I felt my blues just taking flight It's never ever felt so right What are you doing to my heart? What are you doing to this lonely man? It's so hard to play it smart What are you doing to my heart? out there okay um, this is a a, a fun song <laughs> Back to the islands on a warm summer breeze Burned all my winter clothes Cut off all of my jeans Load the boat up with all the beer that you'll stand Haul the sails up, let's get away again Let's go sail The seas were made for sailing And I'm a sailing man Yes I am, yes I am, I am Well, maybe we'll find us a floater or two A round one for me and a square one for you And we'll haul them both up and stash them below And the wind will take us anywhere that you want to go And the sun, the sun, it makes me happy And I'm a happy man Yes, I am, yes, I am, I am All right There's nothing like the feel of a tight ship And she's dancing beneath your feet You feel the spray of the ocean You hear the song on the wind The music of the rigging slapping Makes you happy to be sailing again Yeah, it does Back to the island paradise by the sea I hope Patty Cincinnati is just waiting for me In a hot tub in the casa in the dead of the night Everybody's naked, feeling alright Take me back pretty soon, got him freezing to death The skiff's got a new boat and I ain't seen it yet And the islands are rocking like they do all the time I'm 3,000 miles away with the keys on my mind Yeah, I'm on my mind All right Well, thank you for listening. Uh, thank you, Tiki Man, for having this wonderful program once more, the fourth annual uh, Songwriter Showcase and uh, Key West Bound, keeping the music alive virtually. Um, take care, everybody. Stay safe. Be kind to one another. And now back to the headquarters of Tiki Man Radio, the Chocolate Bar Studios in Harrison Bay. Jerry Gontain, man, I got to oh tell you, that, that's got to that be such a big awesome. thrill for you, Brian, being, uh, you know, like one of his mentors. You're that, his, he, yeah, he is, he your is, mentor. He is yeah. my mentor. He and, yeah. and Hugo Duarte, were the, those are the two that were big influences to me. I yeah. think I told you a story once when we were on stage with him. He plays nonstop. We're yeah. three hours into a five-hour gig, and I had to I pee. I got to pee. I got to pee. I know. Yeah. And I, I know. said, are you going to take a break? He goes, I never take a break. Go pee. <laughs> <laughs> 
Well, now we have uh, one of the rock stars in Key West, Mr. Donovan Lee Carpenter. How you doing, brother? Hey, man, I'm excited. Thank you so much for having us here. We're excited to be a part of Tiki Man Radio Songwriter Showcase. Key West Bound, man. This is just an amazing adventure that you guys put together. Thank you so much. Well, we got a lot of people out here at the old Tiki Bar listening to you here. Yeah, man. Hey, shout out to Harrison Bay. You know, I love the chocolate bar, but that outside bar has kind of been my home here at least <laughs> recently. So you guys out there, don't go to the bathroom now, because when I get up there, you'll got a special surprise coming if you love Tiki Man. Aww. There you go, man. There you go. <laughs> Thank so, you so much. how's uh, your trip down this year? Last year was your first trip down. You was you were fortunate enough to come, and, and we were fortunate enough to have you at the Tiki House. And now you're back for your second year. How's it going so far? Oh, man, I, you know, last year I was overwhelmed with the love. Just, uh, you know, open their arms to me as a songwriter and really making us feel at home. And then this year, all of a sudden, uh, I feel like people are family. They know me. They, they kind of know my story. And I feel like it's just another home away from home, man. I just love it. It's, it's been an amazing journey down here. Well, it's definitely a home away from my home for sure. I mean, I miss yeah. it dearly, and and uh, I would love to be down there. This year was just not right for us, and and Brian and I, yeah. you know, we kind of, you know, decided to do it this way, and we're glad we did because uh, what a cool day it's been to be able to broadcast you guys. Not only did you get to go to Key West and have a good time, but now you're being broadcast around the world That's right. to people around the world. from Key West. And uh, this is really cool, man. I'm glad you're part of it. It is really cool. And I want to uh, let everybody know that, you know, if you're at home, we we do feel your energy, even though you're not here. Uh, as long as you're listening to what we're putting out, man, we feel you, we love you, and we thank you so much from the bottom of our hearts for listening. Because if it weren't for you guys listening, we wouldn't be able to play. So, uh, you know, it just it's an amazing, amazing, amazing thing that we put together here. Thank you so much. Well, you know, you and Crystal, you know, obviously you guys are always welcome like here. Family. You, yeah, you guys came not too long ago and hung out with us for the weekend. We went over and did a show over in East Ridge, Tennessee, right. and uh, uh, had a great time, man. We love you guys, and you're always welcome here. You know that. Hey, man, if you ain't never seen the sun shining down on Harrison Bay, you ain't seen nothing yet. <laughs> <laughs> so I hear you've been kicking around a couple of new songs since you've been down there. Hey, man, we're doing some big stuff. So let me tell you real quick. I'll try not to take too much time, but You're good, uh, buddy. three You're days good. ago, uh, we came down and kind of stopped with a couple of the other songwriters and uh, happened to have the good fortune to be at a place with Daryl Clanton. You guys know Daryl Clanton. I just yeah. love him so much. We yep. had the opportunity to go into the studio while we were there just last Thursday. And when I was back in Nashville, you remember last year, we sat down with Erica Sunshine Lee and her and I wrote a song. Well, we were able to cut the demo of that just the other day. And nice. I can't wait for you guys to hear it, man. Uh, we're writing songs just about every day. And not only that, we, you know, Donovan Lee Music loves to shine a light on songwriters no, no matter where. All that yeah. I need is a good song and I can tell it well. So we're getting ready to meet up with some songwriters and shine a light on them too. Well, all right, brother, you're almost out of time here. We're going to let you go ahead and get up on stage and get ready to play and kick everybody's butt out here at the Tiki Bar to listen to you. All we right, man? Let, you, me, let me hear everybody in Harrison Bay holler. There we go. Thanks, brother. Yeehaw. Fantastic. Hey, we're, we're going to show you a little pan of the crowd here. While okay. Donovan gets up there and does his thing. So get on up there on stage, mister. <laughs> <laughs> Look at the crowd. This, oh, we have very been, nice. This is a really good crowd, and everybody's eating, drinking, having a great time. Yeah, uh, tell everybody to say hi. They're on TV. Say hi, everybody. Tell them they're being broadcast around the world. There you go. How's that? Yeah. <laughs> That's so cool. Oh, we're so excited. Well, there you go. So, hey. We got another commercial coming up for my good friends at Tune Designer who support me. Yeah. So enjoy Tune Designer. Stop dealing with producers who don't listen to you. It's time for you to work with Tune Designer. It's your music. We want to help you make it the best it can be. If you want to take the next step with your music, just get on our schedule and we'll make it happen.
Dave, want to send a shout out to Tiki Man Radio out there at Harrison Bay. Thank you so much for showing up. Man, my name is Donovan Lee Carpenter. I'm so proud to be here. Normally, I do the first song to kind of show you the man that I am. So when I sing this song, it's introducing me to you. But on today, I want to send a special early birthday out to Demar. Heading down this dusty road, a little place nobody goes but me and you. We've been a time or two. Back to our favorite spot Later on it might get hot But until we're there let's enjoy the ride One hand driving with you by my side We're gonna cruise in the country Like we're never in a hurry we're Gonna roll like we're buzzing and swerve Like we're touching on to keep it in the lines When it's you that I'm loving gonna that truck and hit the creek a running I'm gonna jump on in wearing nothing but a grin I can't swim when it's you that I'm loving throw the fishing poles in the back just in case your mama asks we got an alibi Say the fish didn't buy. Drop by the coin car wash and hose this whole truck off. We gotta cover the track before I take you back. We'll go cruising the country like we're never in a hurry. We're gonna roll like we're buzzing and swerve like we're touching holding. It in the lines when it's you that I'm loving Gonna park that truck and hit the creek a-running Gonna jump on in wearing nothing but a grin I can't swim when it's you that I'm loving If there was anyone else riding shotgun I bet you right now, girl wouldn't be half as fun to go cruise in the country like a neighbor in a hurry. Gonna roll like we're buzzing and swerve like we're touching or to keep it in the lines when it's you that I'm loving. Gonna park that truck and hit the creek around and gonna jump on in. Wearing nothing but a grin I can't swim When it's you that I'm loving When it's you I'm loving When it's Key West I'm loving Happy early birthday, brother Man, we're having such a good time here. Listen, I was here the first time last year, uh, and I met a young lady. I don't know if you know her, a gorgeous Erica Sunshine Lee. Yeah, when we got back to Nashville, we hooked her, called her up, said, hey, uh, let's get together and write a song. And uh, we were able to cut this song, the demo, just three days ago. So I can't wait to get this out on Tiki Man Radio. It's called It's a Beautiful Day. Take a little time out, cracking tops and jokes, sitting on the patio. Got nowhere to be, just feeling the breeze. It's 80 degrees and scannered on the radio. Just taking it slow. Hey, hey, life is great. Got a few good friends and I just got paid. Catch a buzz and a couple of rays. It's a beautiful. 
beautiful day. By the barbecue pit, low key kicking it, nowhere better to be than where we are. You can find paradise in somebody's eyes for the perfect view. You ain't got to go too far. Maybe your own backyard. Hey, hey, life is great. Got a few good friends and I just got paid. My kids buzz and a couple of rays. It's a beautiful day. Not a cloud in the sky, I see a pretty face smiling at me, and I gotta say, not a worry in the world, I've got it made. It's a beautiful day. It don't matter your situation. If you broke, you can take yourself a staycation. Relaxation is the perfect state of mind. Don't let the storm cloud your perception. We all need some precipitation to be grateful for that big blue sky. You will find, hey, hey, life is great. Got a few good friends and I just got paid. My kids buzz and a couple of rays. It's a beautiful day. Not a cloud in the sky, I see a pretty face smiling at me. And I gotta say, not a worry in the world, I got it made. It's a beautiful day. It's a beautiful day. A sunshine day. <laughs> thank you so much. Yeah. Oh, man. I want to say thank you so much. I just changed it today. Yep. Thank you so much for coming out. I want to send a thank you out to Tiki Man Radio. I want to send a thank you out to B-Man for allowing us to be a part of this, man. Thank you so much. We're honored to be here. Um, I want to send a special shout out, a special thank you to iDesign361 by Jody Foster. Let me tell you, she takes quality graphics on a musician's budget so you too can have a good, good show, man. Uh, thank you so much. Now, we visited Harrison Bay a few times last year, and when we got home, we wrote this song, brand new, and when we get home, we're going to get in the, in the studio there and record this, but Tiki Man and Hippie Chick and all that's a part of Tiki Man Radio, this is for you. Every Sunday around 10 a.m. He turns that microphone on Pulls his hat down low Got his sweat shades on Come on, everybody hang on The hippie chick is his sidekick She got her tie-dye on uh, Uncle Alex, those blood at my wrist Damn, he makes them strong Tiki Man Radio, he got the music for your soul. Talking about Tiki Man Radio.com. Jim has bells on that brand new stage. He got the first name on the wall. Linda Robin, her tattooed arm, sugar britches bellied up to the bar. And here we are down in Harrison Bay, having the best time of our life. 
So come on over to the chocolate bar. Baby, we can dance all night. Talking about Tiki Man Radio. We got the music for your soul. Talking about Tiki Man Radio. Dot com. Tell me out, y'all. Tiki Man Radio. He got the music for your soul. Talking about Tiki Man Radio. Dot com. Tiki Man Radio. Tiki Man Radio. Tiki Man Radio. YouTube. Music for your soul. See you on the radio. All right. Wow. Wow. That was amazing. Was that awesome or what? That was a very nice surprise. That was a very nice surprise. I was not expecting that at all. I had no idea that was coming. Take him man radio. <laughs> <laughs> I know. Lord have mercy. That that was uh that was amazing. It's been four hours already. I know. I know. I'm telling you, this this day has flown by. It seems like it's taken us 20 years to get here yeah. Yeah. <laughs> in three weeks. Brian? Danny? We did it. We did it, we did yes. it man. Holy crap. Uh, what are we going to do next year? I don't know. This is pretty big, but I want to be at Key West, and I want to be doing video, and I want to be doing radio at the same time. We're, we're going to make it happen, and we're going to. it's going to be bigger. We might even be in our new spot here. Who knows? Yep, who knows? You know, it's just it's one of those things, man. And I, I, I couldn't do it without you and, and Hippie Chief you. And, and Ed the Train Man and Pat behind the scenes helping us out and everybody who gave us videos, clap tracks, you name it, that helped us out. Well, I got to tell you, you know, a personal thanks to uh, Ed and Pat for everything that they always do to support us, not only – uh, when we're in Key West or we're here or whatever, but all year long, you know, yeah. I, mean, it's, uh, I just love those guys to death and they, they're here with us now in the chocolate bar. It's fantastic. Well, you know what? I heard Donnie Brewer's in the house. Well, it's about time to wrap this up then. <laughs> <laughs> hey, when we have Trop Rock Radio in the house coming to see us. Oh, well, yeah. Uh, cool. well, I love don't it. worry. Don't worry about it. We can cut that out of the end of the video, Brian. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Tiki man. I love All you right, guys. Buddy. Love you guys. Love you. Let's, it's a wrap, everybody. Enjoy the outro, everybody. There you go. We hope you enjoyed this year's Tiki Man Radio Songwriter Showcase, Key West Bound. Keeping the music going virtually brought to you by Box Line Box. Special thanks to our sponsors, Key West Trading Company, makers of Wreckers Vodka, Temple Pinch Revenge Rum, and their award-winning Smuggler's Choice Bourbon Whiskey. Beach Buddha Coffee, the best roast from coast to coast. Kermit's Key Lime Pie Shop here in Key West, Florida, and the Parrot Heads of Key West. Hey, this is B-Man, and on behalf of Tiki Man Radio, thanks for being a part of this year's virtual show. We look forward to seeing you all back here in Key West next year for the fifth annual Tiki Man Radio Songwriter Showcase, Key West Bound. Follow us on Facebook at Tiki Man Radio Songwriter Showcase Key West Bound. And for more information throughout the year, follow Tiki Man Radio, B-Man and Michelle on Facebook, and subscribe on YouTube to Tiki Man Radio and B-Man and Michelle. See you all next year. 